Oh, pumpkin berry. Why you do this? Thank you so much. Holy shit. Thank you for the raid. Mr. Larson, thank you for the one, two, three, four, five gifted subs. Appreciate that, mate. Toilet. Clogger. Nice name. Thank you for the eight months. Andrew, thank you for the 15 months. Pumpkin berry. Much love. How are you doing? How was your stream? That's right. Can we talk? Of course. That's why I'm here. Great. I'll just hitch up. Hey, what's up? How you doing? Hey, bitch face. Hey, that's not nice. It's a little pet name, son. Oh, okay. First of all, how are you doing? Doing good, how are you, sweetheart? I'm doing all right. That's Second good. Of all, I'm, I'm not gonna shoot you. <laughs> oh, I know that. Why would I come out here to be shot? Hmm? I ain't I crazy. Maybe I am. I mean, maybe you are, but I don't think so. <laughs> but, you know, I just want to uh, come out here because I have a little concerns. And I'm just wondering if there's any way that we can work things out here. Yeah, I just heard some stuff from Flash, so. All right, good. Uh, I I've... told him that I can't really go out of the West by myself. No, I don't like Baz. You just forget what Baz sounds like. Group less big than six in total. I'll do an example in a second. Because a lot of people fucking want my head right now. All right, I'll tell you this. Uh, I, I can't really speak for the ranch. I don't own it. Mm -hmm. I haven't run it for the last months. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But um, what I can probably do for you, though, is I can guarantee your safety if you want to have a discussion with maybe Eliza and uh, organize something between just the two of you. Yeah, I was thinking that maybe we can just, like, meet three on three at that um, I'm thinking. I'm, I'm, think, I'm thinking one on one. Can I have guys in a like at a distance? Is that okay? I am not there to fight you. I, I don't understand that. I don't want to fight the ranch at I understand all. That. And the only times that it turned out into a shootout mm -hmm. is either because because Jack Kettleman is there, or because the Panthers are there. Okay. Well, and I, I can bring them. I can give you my word that you're not gonna have any fucking trouble. I've spoken to Eliza, and. uh it's very clear to me that she doesn't want no bloodshed. Neither uh, do I. They just want to be ranch folk up there. All right. Now there's a little bit mm -hmm. of confusion because there's some people there that have a uh, friendship with this Jack fella. Uh, yeah, I have no such thing. friendship nor loyalty, as you know. I know. Um, I can talk with her and only her, and uh, we can discuss somewhere to meet, just the two of you. And just fucking hash this shit out. Yeah, enough's enough, right? Yeah. But that's the thing. I can't travel out by myself. Alright, well, if we're talking distance, I mean... Can you bring one, then? Me and her, and you and one other. Depends how far out. Can we just meet at McFarland's? Yeah. That can work. Would that work? Yeah, that can work. Um, Apparently, there was somebody that attacked Emma with some red masks or whatever. Uh, I don't know the I don't know the the details. Sounds vaguely familiar though. I have absolutely no idea who they are. Right. No one here knows who they are because we had tried to have this chat this chat with Jack mm. the last time, and uh, yeah. Everybody was just like, we don't know who those people are. I don't know what you're talking about. And then Jack, obviously being Jack, makes it into a fucking shootout. So, mm. All right, well. But this could have been hatched out like 
before. Well, it's time to hatch this out now because by the looks of it, there's a lot of uh, hostility with this Jack guy and he's caused a mm -hmm. lot of ruffled feathers and there's a lot mm -hmm. of uh, innocent folk up at that fucking ranch that are kind of the meat shield and uh, it's yeah. no good. That, well, well, that's also why I haven't been riding out for the ranch. All right. Well, I'll uh, I'll talk to uh, I'll talk to her, and uh, mm -hmm. I got your telegram, right? Let me just double check, make sure I got the right number here. You have mine. I don't have yours. You That's asshole. That's exactly how I like it. I R two six zero, right? Yes. All right, and uh, okay, I'll be in contact. We'll come up with a, a time and, and such, and uh, you know. Okay. Well, do add your telegram. I will add my telegram. Time. I'll add my telegram instead and, uh, of this sappy goodbye message mm -hmm, that I get, mm -hmm. and then I just have to think about the fact that I can never even reply to you. Uh, I just wanted you one more, sweetheart. All that's all sad. I wanted. Yeah, it's all right. I tell you what. After mm. we get this all cleared up. You know, me and you, we can get together, catch up, yeah. <laughs> Come on. I mean... You let your hair down every is, once in a while too, you know? Queen of the this West. Is, this is going to be a war that is not going to be stopping anytime soon. Boy. Ah. Considering the Chenzos rode it's into not a no. Lawson you yesterday. You didn't say no. Just saying, you didn't say no. Nah. <laughs> and attacked innocence, all right. He's got a little, you know, you got to relax a little bit. Every now and again, nothing wrong with just a little bit of relaxation, you know, a little bit of downtime. You don't have to be worried about getting killed all the fucking time. You know, we can meet up at that that place. Remember? No I one knows. Remember. Yeah, a little secret. <laughs> hmm? <laughs> I love how you keep trying. Ah, uh, well, you didn't say nah. So there you go. <laughs> All right, I'll be in contact, sweetheart. All right. Looking forward to it. You need any drink or food before you go? Uh, no, nah, I got some work to good? do. But, um... Milk runs. <laughs> nah, I got some, uh, some repair work to do. I'm a uh, nailing expert. <laughs> My speciality. I'm sure it is. <laughs> You know it. Uh huh. Take oh, care. You take care. <laughs> I'm a bad man. Thank you for the ten gifted subs, brother. How you doing, mate? How are you doing? Thank you so much, DDR agent. Thank you for the eighteen months. Good to have you here. Man, do you guys forget what Baz sounds like? Like this is Boyd, right? Like, how you doing, fellas? Nice day for a murder. And then there's Baz. All right, guys. You know, uh, I'm fucking Baz fucking kidding, right? You fucking forget what I sound like, you fucking sons of bitches. Like, do you, do you not remember what he fucking sounds like? Have you all gone fucking crazy? Oh, he's got an Australian accent. Must be the same man. She didn't say no, man. I'm just saying, she didn't say no. She was giggling, bruh. She was giggling. That's got to be positive signs, right? You sound like Baz. You are crazy. She also didn't say no the eight times that you said you did to say no. Exactly. PB, that's a good sign, right? She wants, she wants Boyd, man. She wants Boyd. Hey, can you blame her? Look at this guy. Looking all fucking dapper in his oversized shirt. Of course they sound similar. They're, they're father and son. And they grew up in the same part of Australia. But B Baz has a very distinct voice. I think people forget.
I don't know. One one of these days, a woman's going to actually tame Boyd. And uh, that'll be really cool because he's actually a really good guy. He just has this one flaw because he's, uh, you know, not, 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 to, not to dig too deep into the story, but his mother, his mother, when she left uh, Baz, she didn't settle for one guy. She kind of just bounced around a little bit like, 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 a, le like a leaf in the wind, right? Um, so he's got this complex of not attaching himself to anybody. Um, and he's a really lonely guy. He hasn't really fit any anywhere. If you notice the way I'm playing him, he floats to the ranch. Then he goes to like the law office. Then he goes to the hotel. He's kind of all over the place. He doesn't really have a place yet. He's a very lonely guy. Um, and he finds comfort in like the arms of all these women, but... Eventually, that could change. Now, he's getting involved in the ranch. The reason why he's getting involved in this is because last night I logged back on and I had a conversation with some of the ranch folk. And there was a lot of people that, that, that weren't happy. And he spoke to the wife of uh, Todd. And she was like, you know, Todd isn't listening. Todd's fighting this war because of Jack. You know, we need, like, if you could just help us, like, you've got the Kerrigan name. Maybe you can influence and get this to stop. So he ran out here to try to help at the stop. Now, I'm not going to be the one to negotiate the peace. I'm going to leave that to Eliza. Um, but we've got to get the ball rolling, man. So that's kind of what he's doing. He's getting involved, but it's not really his fight. Just a little insight into the character. <clears throat> don't want to go too deep. I don't want to spoil everything for you. <clears throat> Who's the war between? Literally everybody against Jack. And the ranch is kind of mixed up in it. Alright. Are we near McFarlane's or are we past McFarlane's? I'd love to try... Oh, we're past McFarlane's. Should we try the barrel thing? I want to try the barrel thing with the fucking... The cheat code. I want to try it real quick. Let me just try it real quick. We'll have a couple warm-ups and then we'll try it with the... The quick start and see if I can... Get a better time, man. I'm so curious about it. You like the shirt, PB? This is the yeah, this is like the brown one. He's got a white one as well. So it's not actually white. It's kind of like a tan, <clears throat> which I think looks a little bit better than this one. But I guess I found the look for him. This is definitely the look. I wear like a just a like a standard black coat on top of that. seen it before the thing is the thing is pb the reason why you haven't seen it is because the 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 default no one really likes it because of the default look at this check this i bet you've seen this though like that's the default and no one picks it because it looks kind of weird with like the sleeves are up like that but it looks really dope when you pull the sleeves off like that that's when it looks fucking great 
It's like a hidden gem that no one knows about. Don't tell anybody. Because he, 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 honestly, he's kind of hot. All right, and I'm a dude. <laughs> he's like a... Baz's wife over in, Aust in Australia, his ex-wife, she must have been like a 10 out of 10 dude because Baz was not a great looker. <laughs> That's the funny thing. He looks good. And his features are very similar to Baz. So I don't know what the fuck I did with Baz, man. I butchered that guy's face. I don't know how. Because he looked very similar to this, but he... I don't know. <laughs> hey, uh... All right, we'll give this a try. Serial Lurker. Thank you for the 10 gifts of subs, man. All right, let's try this out. Okay, we're going to try without the head start, guys. So I need your timers ready. I thought you put his face on purpose. It kind of was, to be fair. He had no teeth. That was his problem. He had like 12 teeth. All right, here we go. What was that? Too wide? Yeah, but give me the time. Give me the time. Give me the time. You suck. Thank you. 14.8. 14.5. Okay. Give it another try without the head start. Without the quick start. Sorry. I just want to see if it makes much of a difference. All right, here we go again. <coughs> All right, here we go. Good. That was nice. Fuck, I fucked it. Oh no. Oh, it's alright. Okay. Oh shit, wagon. Wagon. How right, was that? Fifteen? There's no way that was slower. <clears throat> I don't think you guys are even timing it. Remember, you gotta start the timer when I go past the flag posts. 14 point. Okay, let's try it with the head start thing. Let's see what happens. Well, not the head start, but the quick start. Let's see if it works. That was a bit wide. That was nice. That was nice. Should be a decent time. What was that? Okay, so that's faster. Okay. It's, so it's around 13.9 to 14. So, okay, that's good. Let's give it one more try and then we'll leave. $40? Oh, shit. Interesting. Yeah, that voice sounds exactly like Boyd. Are you insane? Been absolutely loving the streams. Thank you for doing hey, King, so many doing, lately. Dude? Boyd is great and I'm really enjoying his story. Please, can you do a best of Boyd Grave scene sometime? <clears throat> he must be proud of his son. Much love to you, Verts. Okay, that was that'd be that'd be rough to do. I'll, uh, maybe, maybe. All right, let's give it one more shot. No, that was suck. That sucked. That sucked. I fucked it up. I'll try again. Remember when I hit go past the flags? It's not it's not when I start moving. Always that first barrel, man. Every fucking time. Alright. If I can just if I can just fix that first barrel up, man, I'm going to destroy. 14.1. Okay. If I can just I, I just gotta fix the first barrel, man. If I fix that first barrel, we 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 are in. Okay? We're in. 14.1, 13.0. Okay, so I'm consistently getting close to the 13 mark. And I'm still fucking up that first barrel, which is really good. Because the only time I was getting like 13 or, or, or really low 14s was when I was nailing the first barrel. So with the head, with the quick start, I can get that time without having to nail the first barrel. That's big. So if I can just get that first barrel under control, we can get 
probably for I'm, I'm looking 13.5 i think we can do it i think we can do it duffy thank you for the 40 fucking dollars mate i do appreciate that um yeah it seemed like that could happen um eventually eventually i haven't done a law interview yet do we know what the record is yeah the wreck <laughs> so pb get this yesterday uh, I made a wager with, with one of the law women, uh, Saffron, and we might, we did a wager that I'd, I'd be at least faster than her, and then she goes ahead and fucking gets the, the record, record time. Fucking sucked. Hey, Sarah, what's up? Coffee? 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 When are you going to learn to make coffee and then you make me coffee? I've, I've made you coffee before. Today is opposite day. No, it's not. Why don't you make us coffee? Opposite day? Yeah. Okay, don't make me a coffee. Why don't you make me a coffee? Have because I, I would love to do that. No, you wouldn't. I know, because it's opposite day. What? <laughs> it's opposite day. That's what you said. Can I, can I have a coffee, please? Will you make us coffee? I'm streaming. I can't make a coffee. I'm streaming. Oh. That's part of the rules. Oh. When you're streaming, I'll make you a coffee. No. No, you won't. I've you done won't. it before. What are You've you talking about? done it one time. How many times have you ordered coffee this week? What? How many times have you ordered coffee this week for yourself? Have I ordered coffee? Zero. Once. Okay. Well, that was me getting your coffee. There you go. I'm sorry? Anything else you want to say? Yeah, go fuck yourself. Can I have a coffee, please? I'm just joking. No, go fuck Sarah, I'm real. Uh, Sarah, I, I need one. I literally need one. Uh, I need one to wake go up. Fuck It'll make. Sarah, please. Oh, god damn it. There you go, guys. That was your fucking fault. Someone peer pressured me into saying that. <laughs> uh, listen, don't, don't stress, okay? If she leaves me, she only takes half of my shit. I need to send a fucking telegram. I need to send a telegram to Eliza. Pillow wall tonight. <laughs> yes. That's every night though. I, I put my foot in it every every day, man. This is a daily occurrence. I'm, I'm used to it. By the way, just so you guys know, me and her are joking. Okay, obviously. We have I have a weird sense of humor. I was like this before she flew over here, just so you know, okay? She 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 knew this when she flew over. <laughs> Thank you for the 40 bucks, Duffy. I do appreciate that. Alright, we're gonna do some Civ stuff. I think we'll go to the uh, we'll go to Valentine. And we will uh We'll maybe do some repair work. Uh, PB, wait until you see what we're doing. Uh, but I thought I saw you say I'm doing law without you. Yes, but no at the same time. Because uh, I don't know if I'm even getting in yet. Look at this fucking horse. Does it, look at this. Don't even hitch up their fucking horse, man. G'day. First things first, Eliza. Eliza GX206. Two, two okay, let's not flirt with this woman here, okay? What time is it, guys? EST. Three fifty-four. Three fifty-five. PM, right? EST. 
All right, let's send one to Annabelle. Fuck, what's my telegram? KY857. So I'm write that down. Oops. Thank you, PB. A five seven. right you owe me <laughs> that's right listen half of boyd's charm is that he doesn't have a fucking filter so i have to keep that going okay as, as uncomfortable and cringe as it is it's part of his charm he has zero filter he just says it how it is we literally walked into a war zone yesterday and called Tilly a bitch face in front of like 12 people that are trying to kill anyone associated with the ranch and Kettleman. Sorry, dog. That's... It's alive. It's fine. It's a little bit of brain trauma. It's fine. Which is the woman that slept with... Uh, here? Okay, I'm not... We're not going into this, okay? But there's been a couple. All right? Just, just, gentlemen, don't kiss and tell. All right? He might be a bit of a man whore, but he he he's a gentleman, okay? Let's get that let's get that clear. She doesn't row that talk. It's true. I'm not telling you. That's a stop. Hey PB, when am I gonna meet your character? <laughs> Actually, you probably don't want to meet Boyd. Pavis? Eh, you never know. You never know, man. I ain't saying shit, okay? It would cause a lot of problems though if I got out, but I'm not I'm not saying, okay? It's secret. I really mean that. I'm not, I'm not gonna share it, okay? It's good for story if if anything ever comes out of it ever. But believe it at that. You guys are so stupid. <laughs> uh, can we change the subject? We're changing the subject. We're changing the fucking subject. Let's go to Valentine. Let's get to work, man. Let me get my work music going. What's good, like, like, manual labor music? I guess I could just do the, the Red Dead 2 thing. RP. It's nice chill pace compared to life of crime and being on the run. Thanks, dude. Love ya, Verth. Thank you, man. I love you too. Oh, we need that. We need the hell house building song. It's, it's too perfect, man. It's too perfect. Get that set up. Void the builder. Basically. Basically. This song is actually pretty good for... 
for him. This one's actually pretty good. Let me get this song. Hold on. If I can find it on Spotify. Hold on. I'm still working out how Spotify works. It's kind of... This is the one, right? Is this it? Hey, yeah, that's the one. We're here. Fuck, this horse is exhausted. I uh, put my coat on. It's raining, bruh. Can you check the Discord art section really quick? I made something. Sure, give me a minute. Budge, lad. Thank you again for the eight months, dude. Glad you're enjoying the stream. VOD viewer? No, the, don't worry about the VOD viewer, okay? It's fine. Uh, there it is. Alright, cool. I can just turn this off. Hold on. Sorry about that, guys. Okay. So, we need that. Okay, cool. Get undercover, bro. Anyone here? Fuck. I don't have a bell, man. There's no bell here. Son of a bitch. Get out, mate. Why not in the fucking... Oh, it crashed. So no one heard me this whole fucking time. Hold on. Did it crash? Yeah, it did crash. Fucking team speak, dude. <sighs> okay, we'll try yelling again. There we go. We're back. Anyone in here? No. I've been having a lot of team speak issues lately, man. I don't think I'm the only one, though, to be fair. I feel like it's a ongoing thing right now. Team speak just being a real bitch. is everyone, man? What's a guy got to do to get some fucking solid work? Let's go get a drink. We'll just drink before we work. What could go wrong? 
What could go wrong? We'll get PB to roll dice for me. G'day. Oh, fuck. I pressed the wrong fucking button. Oh, horse is going to come crashing through the door. All right. We need a... A whiskey. All right, PB. Roll for me. How tipsy does this make him? Yeah. What's that mean? What's a 14 mean? S is 20. Worse. So he's, he's okay then. We're good. How you doing, mate? I'm doing fine. Oh, are you, um... You're, you're Mr. Kerrigan. That'd be me, yeah. Uh, carpenter, jack of all trade extraordinaire. Yeah, that's right. Wait, uh, you work at the fucking uh, hotel, right? The bathhouse or no? Yes, yes, that's correct. All right, where's the, where's the boss lady? Yeah, you're the queen of the bathhouse, Christine. Honestly, mm. I was looking for her as well. Seems that's like she's it. not around at the moment. I mm -hmm. don't know. Because I need to get to fucking work and she needs to uh, hire me. On a uh, official basis to fix this fucking joint because it's a, it honestly it's a piece of shit, and come crumbling down any minute. Yeah, I'm not surprised. I was going to say I thought you were going to say that she hasn't paid you yet. Well, that too, she didn't fucking pay me yet, but um, you know we'll get to that when I see her. Uh, when you, when you see her, let her know that boy's looking for her, right? All right. Is there any place specifically you'll be around so then she could just yeah, find I'm you? Gonna, yeah, I'm gonna be in fucking Valentine, ain't I? That's right. All right, perfect, perfect. I'll make sure to let her know then. Good, good. All right, take it easy. Hey, sweetheart. That woman right there is dressed like someone that wouldn't like to be called sweetheart. Let's go check the telegrams just in case. What does it know her name? I, I don't think it's that he doesn't know, it's that he doesn't care. So he doesn't care. Is this my horse? Did I hitch here? And this is my horse. Get on the fucking horse. Have, have I glitched the horse? No. Get on the fucking horse, boy. Get on the horse, boy. Get up. Son of a bitch. So, uh, PB, are you still doing crim? So what's, what's what's the plan with you? What are you doing with your life? Fucking get on, mate. Carter? Get on the fucking horse, man. Punch it. No. You fucking horse! Come on! Fucking move! God damn it! Actually, I gotta be yelling this out so one hears it. You fucking horse! Yeah! A fucking burst! You son of a bitch! Her horse? Oh, yeah, sorry, just having a little bit of a problem here with my steed. Um, he's right, a stubborn right. son of a bitch, you know it is. I, it looks like you're trying to knock his ass out. No, 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 just trying to untie the, uh, you know, the, uh, the reins here. You know, sometimes they right, get a little, little, right. little sticky. <laughs> yeah. Yep. I wonder what are you the one who tied him up in the first place? That would be me. Yep. Right. How how the hell are you gonna have sticky shit on your hands when you tie him up then? Unless I'm hey, you don't want to know how shit. I got sticky stuff on my hands, man. I'll tell you that much right, right now. We don't, we don't need to. <laughs> we don't need nah, to clear about yeah, that. Right you, you can go back inside now. It's, it's, I got this under control. It's fun. All right. All right. Good, Good luck, luck to you, friend. Thanks, 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 fellas. Over. 
in his fucking armor, huh? Fucking mutt! Fuck, what the fuck are you supposed to Alright. You've won this round, horse. You've won this round. Lasso? <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> you really don't want to go off that fucking post, huh? We're gonna walk to the telegram office, is what we're gonna do. We're gonna walk to the telegram office. V-Rex, thank you for the five gifted subs, buddy. How are you doing today? Much fucking love. It's a nice day for a walk. Exactly. Nice morning, sunrise. Beautiful. Beautiful. <sighs> Might be able to hold his drink, but sure affects his ability to untie a knot. <laughs> okay. Okay. I see how it is. Man, we're gonna nail today like we've never nailed before. <clears throat> Appreciate that, V-Rex. I cannot believe she actually didn't get me a coffee. Like, I'm literally struggling. I just woke up and I'm still waking up and I would love some caffeine, but she just ignores me. That's what she said. What did I say? Oh, I'm gonna nail like this. Okay. Wow, you're worse than me. That's why I gotta meet your character. Come on, PB. Come meet Boyd. At the time of our lives. Be great. <laughs> Alright. Fuck walking, dude. This sucks. I know, right? You have to be a special kind of stupid to be friends with Brad, honestly. There's a category for that, I'm sure. How come when you walk in real life, walking seems fine, right? But then when you walk in a game, it feels so fucking tedious and a waste of so much time and effort of your life. Like, it, it just feels like you're wasting your fucking time. But when you walk in real life, it feels so perfectly normal. Like, it's cool. But then when you do it in game, it fucking sucks, dude. Like, I want to run right now. But then we look like a, like some crazy, you know, fuck it, man. I don't think I'm crazy. What's this guy running down the street for? Get an exercise, dude. Get an exercise. That was a thing back in 1901, right? They used to jog and stuff. Sure. They did, right? Who fucking knows? Should probably buy some kind of rifle. Hey, fellas, you looking for some kind of uh, carpenter or handyman or anything? Hmm. Uh, Not really, no. Uh, let me think. Not, yeah, not around here, at least, no. Mm. All right. Yeah, uh, there's a few ranches around that might be able to help you, but other what than that. going on, dude? Might try your hand in strawberry. Plenty of folk out there might need some help. There was a whole lot of folk in strawberry. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, really? I didn't know that. I thought there was a lot of folk here, but apparently not. Uh, it sort of comes and goes. It depends on the time of day. Mm. Have you seen uh, 
uh, fucking what's her name, Christine around. Are you talking about Mama? Yeah, that's that's the one. Yeah, she, she was, was over, over here earlier. earlier. <laughs> where's wait, where's there and what? When was earlier? Yeah, their bathhouse. Maybe how long ago was that at it? Thirty minutes. Uh, yeah, 30, 45 minutes. Oh, so she's around. around. All right, all right. Oh fuck! I guess I just wait around you go for get a bath over there. They yeah. got this is a great service. Oh yeah, I know. I had a bath yesterday with a lovely lady. Name was uh, Adelaide. Mm -hmm. Yeah, real good with her hands. Do you do anything oh, yeah. with your toes? Uh don't don't want to talk about that. Oh lord! What, what, is, what, what the fuck what, is what, happening? What's she do to your toes? Uh, she didn't do nothing to my toes. She was scrubbing me, and then Christine walks in and just starts sucking on my toes. So she's doing it to everybody. What the fuck Damn, is that I thought, all about? I thought, she only did that. I, I thought she only did that to me. I felt special for a little bit. I think Christine's got some sort of locking for toes and things like that. Yeah, it's a little peculiar. It's taking the piggies way past the market, let me tell you. Mm. <laughs> That's one way of putting it. What you looking at? Uh, there's folks coming into town. That fella in the big old... I don't know why that fella's wearing that coat over here. I mean, he's got to be hot. You talking about woman? the man with the uh, goddamn... It's a woman. The one that didn't talk? Oh, yeah. The one that grunted. The one that's like, uh, that I'm right back, fellas. All, All right. right, then. I just walk over here to that king's place or whatever. Get in, mate. Um, I was wondering uh, if the uh, if the uh, the thing was reported. Mate, well, thing? What you what are you talking about now? The uh, the report that I put in. Uh, well, the uh, the warning. Uh, when was this? This was yesterday. Recently, Yes, or? yesterday, mate. Yesterday. Uh, what's your name? Name's Boyd. All right, did you put it on the tip line or? No, nah, no, nah, mate. I uh, told a couple of lawmen over here, and they said they're going to, uh, you know, do the necessary actions. Just wondering, just getting a uh, an idea whether that, whether that's been done or not. Uh, I have a list of daily reports. Let me take a look here. Let me get my fucking little report out to a little notebook. There we go. Okay. Fair enough. See, there you go. Oh, I'm gonna park at the law office. This is exciting. Alright. This is my this is my parking spot. Yeah, hey, it. Sure oh, you nice. got him. I like uh, it. You got it. You boys want a beer or can you not drink uh, on the duty? If it's tall trees, I can drink on duty. No. What the fuck are you talking about? Sweet. Nothing to do with tall trees. You can get this. Uh, uh, saloon. I'll tell you more well, stories about Jesus. Well, I'll, well let me go the, grab some uh, water first, and I'll meet you at the side. The health and well-being of this entire fucking town, isn't it? I am not seeing anything about that. So you're telling me I came over here, gave you guys a solid warning. Something that's very concerning, very alarming. You tell me it wasn't even written down. That is what I'm telling you. You seeing the problem here, son? We can't, son. That's it, I will not to be your daddy. How old are you? 32. No, you don't want to be my dad. No, fair enough. Well, let's get, let's, 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 let's get to the real face. problem, mate. The, the problem isn't... Now. Oh, well, that's all. Well, I appreciate that. But let me just say, we gotta get to the uh, the bottom of this because this is really important stuff. I've been uh, very concerned, very concerned. Can you tell me what the exact problem is then? Is there a sheriff around? I think we're gonna need. Uh, uh, I believe he just escorted the drunk man into the saloon. <laughs> all right, excellent. When he gets back, we'll go over the details. Oh, all right. It's the creep from beyond. All I can all say right. is that we're looking at catastrophe. This is really serious. Business. Wonderful. Yeah. All right. You're taking it seriously, though, right? I am 
taking it as serious as can be till I know what the exact problem it, is. Well, the, the thing is, this might be above your pay grade, so we might just have to just wait. Just, just hold on. I'm just writing uh, that down. Okay, what's your name again? Beckwith. Okay, Beckwith. Didn't know about the catastrophe. Okay. Very interesting. Very interesting. How long you been a moment for? A month and a bit. You've been here for a month. Yep. All right. Like I've experienced this thing. You know, it's not surprised then, is it? Suppose not. Hmm. All right, let me just write that down. Lack of experience could be the reason for the inefficiency. I got it. Interesting. <laughs> I'm just completely fucking just besmirching this guy to his face. All right, well, I'm going to get on my chair then. No, hold on, hold on. You, 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 this is not news that you want to be relaxing for. This is serious business. Yeah, well, I just got shot in the chest, so. Holy shit. How'd that happen? I didn't listen to a bunch of shits with guns. Wow, bunch of fucking assholes out there, huh? Yeah, well, I didn't want assholes to get access to an armory, so I made something they couldn't. How'd you do that? Broke a key in a lock. That sounds like a smart move. Well, I thought it was pretty clever. Do you feel clever? No, I feel like I've been shot in the chest. <laughs> Hey, Maple, did, well, did you see what the sheriff went when you were Yeah, we need a sheriff. Uh, no, I thought didn't. Monroe was down by the saloon. He was taking that fat, All right. drunk All right. fella. All right, uh, I'll go I'll get him. Look. I'll go get him. I'll All go right. get him. Oh, you're going to get him? Okay, good. All right. I'll get back to my, uh, my notes then. So what do you do then, Mr. Board? I'm a, um, a nailing expert. It's gonna be a termite problem or something. I nail for a living. That cop, and then right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When it comes to nailing things, sir, no one does it better. Well, you got a lot of sheriff office to fix, sir, that's for sure. I've already fixed some of the sheriff's office, but uh, if you if you fellas need me to do more, we can discuss it. This is, this is looking a little bit rickety. Oh, here he comes now. Fantastic. Alright. We've got all the law. Wait, man, how many fucking laws here? Oh, shit. Okay. Bob in the houses. <clears throat> Highway, man. Alright, okay. Alright, which one's the sheriff? Be I'm gonna just check the tips. Alright, I need to talk to you, sir. Uh, what's, it, what's it about? A very important issue. Catastrophe is uh, is upon us. Catastrophe. I don't like catastrophe, so yeah, we best right. talk. I did report this, but uh, it seems to me that whoever I spoke to didn't take it seriously and never wrote it down, uh, which is very concerning, very concerning. It makes me question uh, a lot of things. But that aside, we can go over the, the finer details. Let me introduce myself. My name's Boyd Kerrigan. Uh, I think we met a while ago. Yeah, I'm a, a handyman, a jack of all trade, and uh, a nailing expert. Make sure you write that down. Nailing expert. Okay. That's right. Okay. So, uh, where did uh, Claymore go right there? Um, yeah. There's got it. a bear right. pack north of Wallace Station. Apparently, there's a bunch of people injured out there. So, um, so I put we're talking. We've got some very important here. Would you? Could you? You know. Uh, just give me give me one second, boy. Just the best thing to do is just get it on the medical board and head up there yourself. Nothing okay. like doing what I love. All right. Wait, okay. Uh, all right. I'll, I'll have to slip that note. in We're somewhere. We're gonna put it on a medical board. There's a bunch of people. Oh, no, no. It's probably there's all there's them people dressed station. up like expeditioners, yeah, like archaeologists. Yep. Seems like their expedition was cut short. Yeah. No, a bunch of them left strawberry about <laughs> 15 minutes ago <laughs> yeah, all in like explorer good. time. All right. Sorry, Mr. Boyd. Carry on. No, no. It's obviously, uh, you know... Making jokes and stuff is obviously okay. more important. Um, but uh, 
That's fine. We'll, 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 we'll discuss that later when I go to the marshal. Uh, so we're going to uh, discuss uh, ongoing problem in the town of Valentine here. So uh, I have recently been hired to do some carpentry work within the, uh, the town limits. Uh, that would include this, this office here. I did some repair work on some gunshot uh, damage. And I recently got hired to do the bathhouse down the road. Now, a couple things about the bathhouse you need to know, sir. Okay. All right, first of all, that place is uh, beyond decrepit. In fact, it's maybe one of the worst held together structures I've ever seen in my life. And it has the potential to maybe collapse uh, at any moment, causing catastrophic injury to anyone inside and surrounding it. Um, I thought the problems just started there, but sir, that was only the beginning. Not only are we looking at damaged walls and uh, boardings, the ceilings collapsing in on itself. Sir, they have an infestation of termites. Well, I called it termites. Why aren't you fucking smart, la de dee They have anyway, an infestation. There's an infestation problem, sir, and uh, as we speak right now, those little creepy crawlies, they're making their way underneath the thoroughfare boardwalk, making their way to all kinds of fucking structures in the town. It could be... We're looking at mass damages, sir. Mass damages on an epic scale. But lucky for you, your local nail expert right here, can potentially help avoid such a catastrophe. But I thought it was very important for Law to know that um, that we are looking at maybe potential uh, serious, serious damage if we do not get to work as soon as possible. Are you saying that the entire town could collapse yes. if we do not deal with these termites? That's right. The termites, they eat from within. Do you know much about termites, sir? No, please do explain All every right. detail about termites. Uh, Alright, give me one second. <laughs> Wikipedia. <laughs> Alright, I just get flipped through my pages here. Alright, you, uh, you ready to write this down? I am ready. <laughs> Alright, so termites... Uh, they're insects that are classified as a taxonomic rank of in, uh, in Phara order Asopetra. Uh, are alternatively known as Epiphimemilia termadio, which is Greek for uh, termite. Uh, within the Batolia, uh, along the cockroach line of the species, uh, termites are also classified as uh, serpents. Uh, they're also maybe uh, considered roaches if you were... Uh, uh, type of roach and uh, sort of the uh, the tree um, but we're looking at the, the most recent estimates suggest that you know that they have an origin uh, during the Jurassic times uh, with the first fossil recorded just a few years ago we're looking at an ancient very strong and durable species um, they're like ants and some bees and wasps, uh, but they're separate from the, the Homo Petra. Termites divide as workers and soldiers, you see. They, they're usually very sterile, um, but they do colonize. Uh, all colonies have a fertile uh, male known as the king, and then there's the more fertile females called the queens, right? And the termites, uh, they feed on, uh, on mostly uh, wood, uh, they move around, they, they chomp their way through all kinds of timber. As you can see, this town is majority timber, except for the bank. But then again, uh, the boardwalk surrounding the bank is uh, definitely timber, so that's a potential problem. Termites are among the most uh, successful groups of insects on Earth, just so you know, uh, colonizing most land masses, uh, except for Antarctica. Uh, their colonies range in size from a few hundred individuals to several million and that's what you've got to be concerned about because maybe you could have a a million termites chewing through the wood right now let me ask you a question sheriff do you respect wood i always respect wood but then you should know that term Kerrigan. termites don't respect wood they're breeding out there right as we speak they're fucking all over the place 
And they're popping out little other termites. And those little termites are going to be fucking each other and popping out even more. If we don't put an end to this, there ain't going to be no Valentine. So what's the most effective way to uh, treat the problem? Well, I'm going to suggest that we, uh, we uh, use a extermination technique and uh, controlled smoke will uh, help kill the problem. It's going to be very expensive. Uh, we're talking <laughs> potential thousands here. Or we could go down the cheaper route and get some dynamite. Dynamite. Yeah, yeah. Small port, like small little, like, uh, controlled detonations could fix the problem. You gotta find the nest, you see, where the, where the king and queen live. And do you, have you found this nest yet? Well, that's, that's, that's what I'm here for, sir. I need to be, uh, paid. I'm, I'm gonna be talking to the, uh, the, uh, the, the bath lady, whatever her fucking name is, Christine, but I got a feeling that she ain't gonna have the money to, uh, start the proceedings. I got a feeling that she's gonna want to skimp out on this, which is why I'm, you know, coming to you, because this is a bigger problem than just the bathhouse. Right, okay. The future of this town's on the line, sir. The future of this town is on the line. I mean, fortunately for me, it's not my town, it's Sheriff Lewis's town. Well, um, I haven't seen her, sir. What, I'm, what I can do, I've wrote all this information down. I just need you to repeat what the Greek name is for the term, mate. It's very important. You fucking asshole. Alright, that would be the uh, Infra Order. Isopateria. Mm -hmm. Can you, you spell that? Yes. <laughs> I N. Uh huh. F R A. Yep. O R D E R. Mm hmm. I S O. Yep. P T E R A. Got it. Okay. Thank you. All right. That's good. So, uh, see, I think the smoke would be the better way to go here. Yeah, yeah, the, the problem with that is, is that we're, you know, it works better in a small location. Something like the, uh, the bathhouse, we're gonna have to really put a lot of effort in, because we're gonna have to cover that whole house to keep the smoke inside, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Is there any kind of mineral that we can use to, like, cut them off, stop them from leaving that, uh, leaving the hotel? <sighs> well... I could look into it, I can do some research. There might be some kind of concoction that we can come up with and surround it. Uh, we're gonna have to fill that entire fucking hotel with fire. Like, uh, we're gonna have to make some campfires and make sure they're safe and we have to light that sucker up and just let it smoke, baby. Yeah, yeah. That would, uh, I'm fucking hell, okay. I can well, work I mean, out we'll the details, to... yeah. We'll have to speak to Christine, because if she she runs it, she won't she won't own it. So I don't think she's gonna wanna wanna pay the money. So if you do your research uh, yeah. and speak to Christine, I can speak to Sh Sheriff Lewis and uh, see see how far she wants to go with this. All right, all right, I'll get on to it. But I would suggest that when you do speak to Sheriff Lewis, that you make sure that she's aware of just how dangerous this infestation is. I uh, will. I've got it. I've got it wrote down word for word, pretty much. All right, fantastic. Okay. Well, I'm glad that someone actually took this seriously. I came here early, and the deputy was just looking at me and said, "All right." And then, uh, obviously, didn't write it down a single fucking thing. Well, I just all I have is a, a vision of the bank standing there and those cells to the side of you standing there and once, that's they're, it. once they're done. Yeah, that's it. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, that concerns yeah. me. And the doorknobs, they'll be there too. Yeah, the doorknobs, yeah, they'll still be right there in that position. Yeah, yeah. Okay, Mr. Kerrigan, well, like I said, I'll uh, pass this information on to uh, Sheriff Lewis for you. All right, fantastic. Well, I appreciate your time, sir. Do you want to take my telegram just so you can keep in touch with me? That would be, that would be, yes, ideal. Let me just get my little book here. All right, what is it, sir? Fuck, that's a good question. Attack chicken, hold on. Attack chicken? Yeah, it's attack chicken something. But give me a sec. <laughs> Valentine has fallen, man. Before Lua Lou, thank you for the 57 months, bro. Oh, is oh, Lacey, how you doing? Uh, it is a, a attack chicken 843. 
And what's your name again? Sheriff Logan Munro. How do you go about doing your research? Do you need books and stuff, or what do you need? Uh, research? Uh, yeah, yeah. So, uh, I'll head over to St. Denis to the library and just start doing some research about these, uh, amphibious creatures. I've also got a friend, uh, Barkley Ogleton. He's a bit of an animal expert. I'll probably get him on the case as well. Ogleton, okay. Yeah. Do you need any money for the research just to, just to help you out get your start? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, that'd be appreciated. Uh, we're looking probably at the sum of uh, probably start off things, maybe $300. I was thinking like $100. Yeah, well, that's because you're not taking it as seriously as you need to. So these are, these are amphibious beings. For, I'm thinking bucks. How many bucks do you need? Yeah, what's that? Books. Bucks. Oh, books. Yeah, but, but you're not, we're not just paying for the books, sir. We're, we're paying for the... The time that I'm putting in, the compensation, I could be out there, you know, doing some manual labor, as well as Mr. Ogleton, his time and effort as well. We're talking $300, sir. Make it worth our while. Oh, right. Come to the bank then. What's an amphibious creature, man? I have no... <laughs> Just making shit up. I want to see this research as well when it's done. Oh, yeah, you're, you're going to see the full research, sir. I'd like a presentation, you and Mr. Ogleton. Yep, that's fine. We're just gonna give that all to Barkley. He can do all that. We'll just get paid. Amphibious is like a frog. Yeah, same thing, man. All right. I can't believe this works. That's there because, you go. That's because uh, he respects the RP, man. It's about the RP. All right, appreciate that. Uh, I'll get on the case right, right away, sir. All right, good. Okay, I'll see you soon. I expect a telegram. Yes, you will. Two thousand bucks, man, on the dot. On the dot, man. You charlatan? No, I'm actually role-playing these termites, okay? Lacey, I'm actually legit RPing at these termites, okay? I mean, OOC, I'm definitely a charlatan. But in character, this is legit, all right? So fuck off. You want me hey, hey, Lacey, would you rather me go join the fucking war? Because I can do that. I can put the entire Kerrigan name behind the fucking war effort. I'll do that if you want. You want to fucking go? We can go. Where is this bitch, man? I'm new. Is this a modded server? Uh, they, they've definitely modded it. Yeah, it's a roleplay server, though, man. If he does it on blackjack, no, we're not going to bet that. Get in. Down now. Howdy. Right. Get in, get in. Hey, you sound good. LJ. All right, I sound fine. I am, I am. LJ. LJ. My boy. Yeah, I want to role play Who with him. Doctor Tedrick Nelson. Uh, he's a doctor that died. Oh, LJ. Well, of course, this is a I bit. I see my oh, horse and spawn back now. It looks like I'm following, but I'm not. I'm just going over here to spawn my horse. All right, let's go check telegrams. Do I know that woman? Have I asked her out on a date? I don't think I have. You could hold the nails. All right, let's go check telegrams real quick.
No, pardon me. Sounds so sad. You make me feel worse. Actually, I don't need this music anymore when I'm investigating. <laughs> this is when we're investigating the termite situation. Okay. He's gonna rob me. I got no money, man. Nice pants. Thanks. Uh, nice. Um. Everything. Canteen. Yeah. That's right. I need a long rifle. I don't need a long rifle. Why would I, why would I need a long rifle for? The only, the only situation I would need a long rifle is if we came across wolves. Because we're not really hunting. We're not expecting any fights with anybody. We are, for all intents and purposes, a civilian at this point in time. Dude, I still don't have Barkley's fucking telegram, dude. Shit. We gotta run in. Hopefully, we run into him today. I wanna see what Boyd and Rufus would get along. Like, they probably wouldn't, dude. Like, at all. <laughs> at all. What are you, crazy? Valentine's handyman. I think we've got to go to a different town, man. Look for some more work. There's no work here. We need to go find some work. We need to make some money. We just made 300 bucks from doing nothing. So now we have to make more money for actually doing something. We'll go past here one more time. See if there's anyone in here. Doesn't look like there is. Uh, no. Hey, wait, someone was in there. Oh, shit. No, it's just the NPCs. Okay. Let's go. Uh, buy a varmint rifle and just unload into the wall to get the termites. No, we're going we're gonna to put like a hundred fucking campfires and crash the whole server, dude. I think, that, I think I like that plan way more. Let's go strawberry. You haven't looked at strawberry yet. That would be the last case scenario. Okay, what we'll do is, hey, this is what we'll do. This is what we'll do. <laughs> we'll kill all the termite soldiers with the smoke, and at the very end, we'll be like, okay, now there's just the king and queen. Now it's like the boss fight. And then we'll get the varmint rifle and start smashing the walls and be like, and we'll walk out like we're heroes. Like we, we saved the day. We killed the king and queen. That's what we'll do. Done. We'll do a hybrid of the two. Okay? Sound good? We agree. Oh. Doesn't get fucking uh, destroyed there. Fuck, oh, man. I'm gonna, I want, I'm gonna sneeze so bad. Okay, it's gone. <sighs> Walk out like Ghostbusters? Yeah, like Ash. From Evil Dead. We came, we saw, we kicked his ass. <laughs> yeah, that's how I walk out. Groovy. We need. I need to get. I need to get some art made of Boyd. Like this. What we need, we need to get this done. Where is it? There it is. That. That poster. With Boyd. For sure. And instead of a chainsaw, he's holding a hammer. Gotta get a lady first. Man, we put all the ladies on there. Why settle for one, dude? Oh shit, 
I missed. Ah, okay. And then... we'll, put, we'll put Pavis there. Perfect. We'll wrap Pavis around his leg. She'd love it, man. Lacey would buy the fuck out of that shirt. <laughs> oh. Gonna force perma me? No. You, there's no way. You can't even, you can't even get one over Wallaby. When have you ever got one over Wallaby? Never. That train clip? Oh, you mean the scuff? Oh, please, please find it. G'day. Is that McCarthy? I don't think she heard me. Oh, she's got her rifle back. She got her rifle back from, um, from Rufus. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. That's sick. I'm glad. I'm so glad she got that back. That's why I was telling Rufus to hold on to it, like use it. Cause I wanted her to get it back, man. Is there anyone around here that owns any of these fucking buildings or at least role plays it? Wonder who the, who's, the, who's the sheriff of Strawberry? That was fucking creepy. Oh god, are, are you fucking following me, mate? That's your first, bud. Preemptive following? So if, anything, if anything, you're following me. I've heard that about you, Lon. What about us? You know? The way you follow people. I'm not too sure what you're on about there, bud. It's like a Canadian thing, right? Not as far as I'm aware. Oh, okay. Hey, cat. How are you doing? Look at this. Look at this. All right. Hey, little puss puss. Dude, cat likes me. I can't pat it though. That's adorable. That's adorable. Man, I thought this was supposed to be full of fucking people. There's no one here. I guess we have Blackwater. We can go ranch. Check out the ranch. See if there's anyone down at the ranch. Then uh, go to Black. Let's talk to, let's talk to McCarthy first. See if we can get a date with her. Dubzy RP. Think of the T1 sub, dude. Oh, there's multiple here. Okay, we can't make our moves then. That's better. I think it was very cool. G'day, g'day. Hello. Uh, how you all doing? Pretty good, how are you? Howdy. Pretty good. Uh, I'm just letting you know, uh, name's Boyd. Uh, I am a, uh, handyman. Uh, carpenter. Nailing expert. If there's Nailing a... Nailing expert. That's right. If there's any, uh, you know, work to be done around the town here, just let me know. I can uh, repair uh, whatever needs to be repaired. Okay. Wonderful. Wonderful. Keep that in mind, boy. Can All you right. repair broken hearts? You know what? That's my speciality. Because I'm about to break a lot of hearts. Oh, I, oh. Well, oh okay. I, all right, then. Well, I wish you would... Good to know. Well, man, wait, man, what are you going to do that for? Well, see, there's plenty of would be suitors, but there's only one I want, so all the other guys are gonna have their hearts broken. Oh. Oh, oh. Who are these fellas? Oh, you know, just, uh, Sonny and James and Cliff, mm. Lloyd, Jeff, Boyd. and, uh... Why are you putting me in there for me? Jack. I said Floyd, not oh, Boyd. Oh, Floyd. Floyd. You sound like all make-believe. I don't, I don't have a list of suitors after me, huh? What's that about? <laughs> yeah, where are you meeting all these guys? You just gotta flirt with everyone. Yeah, that's, oh, okay. that's one way to do if it. You, yeah. Christ. Spread the spread it far and wide. See what's the uh, no, flirt sticks, I guess, right? Just flirt, just you know, <laughs> keep the knees crossed. 
Oh. <laughs> and who's the one suitor you've decided to choose? Oh. Oi! Just fucking Didn't left do him. anything worthy Look of Look who the fuck it is, huh? Boyd. How you doing? Good to see you. What are you up to? Uh, catching up with a friend. Oh, pardon me. Pardon oh, yeah? me. Sorry oh, about yeah? that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You getting up to no good? Howdy, what are you doing? No, discussing recent events. Oh, hey, Moon. Right, right, right. You know what? We need to, we need to mm -hmm. catch up and get a drink or something. No. That was an interesting conversation. Don't let me stop I you. I suppose we do. Yeah, it's fucking right, it's we do. It's been. Uh, now I'm not on morphine, so I actually can drink something. Wait, you went drinking last time? I was on morphine. Apparently that kills you or something. Oh, right, right, good. right. Yeah, yeah, that yeah, doesn't sound good. Holy shit. Yeah, it sounds like a mo load of mumbo jumbo. Right, so how's your, how's your business partner friend doing? Howdy, Moon. Hey. Uh. Oh, you're walking You know, the car. asshole. The, oh, uh. Um, he. Yeah. Uh, I mean, uh, he's well physically. Are heading up north to Karen Lake. Oh, yeah? Yeah, a bit testy, but he always is. Right, right, right. Let's get a drink. Yeah, let's get a fucking drink. I'm gonna get out of black water. That's what I'm gonna do. Hey, sweetheart. Oh, Lord. <laughs> okay, no Eliza yet. All right, I'm gonna get a black water. Uh, I'll meet you there. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna stop by the ranch first anyway. No one stop you. That's me horse. <laughs> Poor case surrounded by law. He must not be wanted. He must not be wanted. Which would be quite impressive considering they're doing the whole war thing. You'd think they'd all be wanted. I never seen uh, Strawberry busy. Well mate, the server's popping bro. Service popping. We got like over. I don't know how many we got now. Probably a hundred playing right now. Not even peak hour. Hey, just Jason Phoenix. How you doing, dude? Oh, I found out how much OOC time kids getting. By the way, guys, went the wrong fucking way. I think. Where the fuck am I? Uh, we. Uh, kid is getting uh sixteen OOC. a lot yeah i know yeah <laughs> so i did i did how much was the last one 13 so i did 13 ooc came back for three days and now i'm doing 16 ooc it's rough man well for lua lou think about 57 months Uh, I have no idea where I'm going. I think I gotta go this way. Yes, yeah, the way. A lot of Boyd. Yeah, at least we got Boyd. That's something. I didn't have this last time. Might as well give him the rope. Yeah, yeah. Maybe next time, maybe next time I'll just let them execute me. I don't fucking know. I don't think I can. I don't know if I could do another big OOC stint with him. The fuck am I? It's foggy. Wolves are coming. Logo is a cattleman. Get away. Am I going to do both these stories at the same time? Uh, dude. I don't really want to stream in Sissica. Oh, 
I'll see if anyone's here. If no one's here, we'll go straight to Blackwater. There is a horse here. Whose horse is that? You put, will you RP it uh, as you were in the hole the entire time? I don't know what I'm going to do yet, man. That's the honest truth. I got no idea. Hello there. Do you not do that, please, ever again? Do what? Just sneak up on me like that. I didn't. I walked over and said hello there. I didn't fucking hear you. All right, well, that's not my problem. You gotta, you know, clean your ears out a little bit. Maybe Can I help you with something? All right, why so testy? Well, you know, I... During these times, you always have to be. You always have to be testy? Hmm. I was being Cautious. nice, you know, I was being nice. I was being, you know, Oh, warm. you were being nice. Yeah, I said, warm. how you doing, sweetheart? That's, mm -hmm. that's a nice greeting, is it not? Uh, that right there would get you punched in the face. What would get me punched? How you doing, sweetheart? Okay, I didn't say it like that. Uh, I said, how you doing, sweetheart? What's wrong with Who that? Who are you? What's wrong with that? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? I'm Boyd. Okay. <laughs> You work at the ranch? Uh, sort of, kind of, maybe. Mm, I'm Rennie. You're Rennie. Never heard of you. Never heard of you either. That's good. We're even on even playing field then. So what do you do? You live so. in? What's going on? Visiting. Oh, so you're a visitor? Sort of. Yeah. Let's oh, go with see, that. I, see. I know Eliza and Todd. Oh, right, right, right. Are you all right? You sound very, like, high-strung. I'm fine. Mm. I know, you threatened, to, better. You, you threatened to punch me. Well, I mean, I've had things happen to me where my guard was down, so... All right, well, you know, you, that doesn't mean you've got to treat everyone like they're, you know, hostile. Mm. That's just me, though. I'm a nice guy, you know? Usually when people say they're they're a nice person, it turns out to be the quite opposite. I think that's me supposed to make that judgment of you, right? Mm, Instead of you telling mm. me that you're a nice guy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This, this is more of the paranoia and the high strongness that we're talking right. about. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So you're, mm -hmm. you're skeptical of everybody. You know, everyone's out to get you. Everyone's trying to hurt you. I don't trust easily. Someone so. says, hello, so. sweetheart. You want to punch him in the face? That's not normal behavior, love. Like I said, I have my reasons. All right, fair enough. Maybe, you know what we should do? Maybe, hey, you, want, you want to have a drink? You want to go for a drink? I'm going to go for a drink. Where? Yeah. yeah. Now we got to Blackwater, get ourselves a drink, you know. You know, relax a little bit, you know. Get to know each other. Maybe then you might want to punch me. Okay, but you're buying. No, that's a fucking lootly. <laughs> All right. So what is it that you do? Good question. You got a job? No. I do work here and there. All right. I'd like to do more, maybe help at the ranch. I do like Eliza and Emma. Oh, uh, so you're looking for some work then. You know, I'm a, I'm a bit of a handyman, carpenter, nailing expert. Oh. Yeah, I'm always you looking good at for... what you do? Sweet, I'm the fucking best at what I do. Alright. 
like a man that's confident, that's I guess. Right. No one nails a nail quite like, uh, you know, like me. It's in the bloodline. I'm from a long list of hard workers, hard yakka stuff. Hmm. I like fighting. I think I'm really good at it. Oh, I can tell you like fighting. You wanted to fight me as soon as you seen me. You know, usually I try to resort my conflict and fighting instead of drawing my weapon because sometimes anyone can pull a fucking trigger. It's a permanent choice if you kill them or not. But mm -hmm. when it comes to uh, using your fist, it's like they can always get back up, you know? Right, right, right. Yeah, okay. So you're, uh, you're a feisty one. You're like, you know, you got a little bit of little fire in you. Yeah, I guess you can say that. That's all right. I like a little bit of fire. Keeps you warm at night. Why'd I say that? Why'd I say that? Why'd I, I don't think I've seen you around here recently before. <laughs> Did you come back from like a vacation or something? Yeah, yeah. So I uh, I was over here and I went back to Australia uh, to deal with some uh, family matters and uh, just recently came back. I see. Look at this. Nice, nice sunrise. Look at that. Ain't that, ain't, ain't that adorable, huh? You know, I think I like more sunrises than sundowns. Yeah, it's just it's the beginning. That's why. Exactly. So, uh, what's your, what, what's your drink? I like rum. Rum. Ah, oh, fancy gal. Gourmet rum. All right, let me get that for you. Yeah. You travel a lot? Yeah, it's actually what I do. I, uh, I don't stay in one spot. I just move around. <laughs> My dream, travel. I really want to see New York. In California. You want to see you want to see the world, huh? Or just the uh, country. I guess the country. There you are. I haven't really been out of the crossing. Well, you should. I was uh, born in London, and then uh, we came over here. Ah, oh, right, right, yeah, okay. You're a palm. Boyd. Hey! You say that? Hey, Kanikla, look, I found this lovely lady. We're sharing a drink. Oh We're getting to know each other. Hi, Kanikla. It's nice to see you. <laughs> nice to see you too, Renny. I see you've met Boyd Kerrigan. Yeah, he scared the living shit out of me at the ranch. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Yeah, she didn't like how I walked up to her and said, Hey, you doing, sweetheart? She said she's going to punch no. you in the face. I did. I did. And now she's what having... did you? Well, nah, nah, nah. We, you know, we, we sorted out our differences, and now we're having a lovely drink together. Ain't that right? Yep. She's getting <clears> completely <throat> fucking wasted. It's good. Ugh. So you're a pom, huh? A what? Not you, I her. She's a pom. Pommy. You know what a pom is, Kanikla? I have, have no clue. This actually be fun. I want you to start guessing what you think a pommy is. Someone who wants to be near palm trees? No, try again. Say it again. Uh I said you're Pommy. a pommy. You're a pom. Pommy. Yeah, you know what that is, though, right? No. You don't know what you don't even know. What, you don't even know what you are. No, actually, because when I was five, that's when we moved and came over here, and now we shopped at the Norfridge. So. Yeah, but you're still a pom, though. 
Still don't know what the fuck what it is. What is a palm? I don't fucking know. <laughs> he won't tell us. Typical pommies, huh? Okay. Oh, now I'm a palm? Mm. <laughs> no, nah, you don't a palm. Uh, a pommy, a palm is uh, someone, uh, uh, you know, an uh, English English person. Someone from England. Yeah. Call them pommies. What a horrid insult. It's not an what insult. What a terrible it's, thing it's, to it's, say it's some, to not, someone. It's not an insult, though. It's a... Uh, Term of endearment. It's like calling it's like call me Aussie. Same thing. I see. Ugh. Who's this pretty lady? That'd be you. Hmm. Smooth. I'll give you that one. <laughs> Howdy. <laughs> Hey, Kanikla, let me talk to you for a second, maybe. Oh, you know, you know, you know this broad? Yes, I know, Renny. Uh, you got any advice? Any moves I can make here? Um, uh, hmm. You gotta be my wingman. Be I'm my, really bad at this be, part. Be my, wi be my wingman. I, I kind of have no experience with it. it be, but you can, like, you can, uh, point, you know, I can help you out a little bit. You can help me out. I'll help you out. I'll owe you one. Yeah, and you can help me pick up chicks at a <laughs> Yeah, yeah, we, yeah, I, I can owe you. Exactly. I could be your wingman next time. How about that? I. I don't think you'd like to be my wingman. Well, you don't know that, Kaniklo, but let's not worry about that first. We gotta worry about the, 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 the problem at hand here, and that's a, how do we get her to like me? All right, we're gonna come up with ideas. Hmm. Well, what about being your authentic self and honest? Well, that's what I'm, that's what I always do. But uh, you know, it, you're just like an enhancer. You're an enhancer. So, I avoid... Hmm. Hmm. Oh, you just gotta laugh at all my jokes, and then you gotta be like, Wow, what a man! Some stuff like that, you know? Like, okay, just, I can... Just make me look good out there, you know? Alright, okay, I think I got it. You got it? You sure? Yes. You don't look like you got it. You look very, like... You look very iffy. I'm actually, you're starting to concern me a little bit, like, you're, you're going a little bit pale. Uh, this is, uh, all very, very new to me. All right, well, you know what? The, you know, the only way to get experience is by what? Doing. Exactly. So, we're going to go in there, and you're going to be the goddamn best fucking wig man ever, huh? Huh? All right. That's oh, fucking right. That, that hurt. I'm sorry about that. All right, get yourself a drink. You know, lubricate yourself. Well, I bet you get to do a lot of adventure hey. doing that too. What with All riding right. the carts around. Let's get let's get more drinks, huh, sweetheart? Let me get let's get another rum for you. I'll get another whiskey. Hold on. There you are. Well, it was good to meet you. It's good to meet you as well, Nancy. Good meeting you, Nancy. You. I love the hair. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, you're welcome. You have a lovely, well, I hope lovely you folks day. Have a good day. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, sorry. Excuse. Sorry. Oh, oh that's all right, sir. Don't worry about it. All right. Excuse, excuse. Hey, hang on, Aisha. I have a drink before bed. Right, yeah, she had good hair, but... Okay. You know, yeah, let me grab you one. Not like yours. Like, yeah. Are you flirting with me? No, we just met. Uh, not... Not you, not... sir. She's talking to me. Oh, I could start flirting with you if you like right, what right. you see. Let's, let's, let's step over here. Come over here. Come over here. Hey, you're uh, looking for a bed? A bed, yes, my. I mean, I, I guess you could say. I just watched I mean, my if, dick. if if uh, noticing your beauty that's, and how that's, that's gorgeous you are, dick. and uh, 
bring that to your attention would be considered flirting, then I would say would that's yeah, that's from probably how what I'm doing. I've been riding him, so I just gave him a bite. Mm. So much cringe, yeah. I know. You're really handsome yourself. You have really great features. I like the way you dress. Yesterday, you always got to make sure. However, there's someone else in mind for me. Yes. Yeah, oh, you know what? Well, that's good. You well, the like thing is this: is that I'm not really looking for. Uh, I'm not really looking for like uh, like a long-term relationship anyway. So mm -hmm. um, what? I'm you know, talking about my horse. That's 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 not a problem. I understand. I know that uh, it's first owner. But you know what? Can I get you, can I get your telegram? You should feel proud actually. Sure. If you, I mean, if you're you rode him before me, yeah, hold on. you rode the horse of local celebrity Scooter Brown. All right, go ahead. S E Southeast one nine two. And you, I'm going to go put All right, my go head ahead. down now. So what happened? Well, you know, I could, like, telegram you. We could, like, uh, hang you out and stuff. Race, okay. You know? No pressure, well, though. No, no pressure. No bar. pressure. Let me, don't, let me help you up there. Don't okay, think like I'm going to push any floor, kind of relationship on you or nothing like that. Just, you know. Oh, so, sorry, don't mind me, ladies and jelly spoons. Right on you. All right up here. Yeah, um, you ever had a telegram. celebrity stay in your we'll, uh, place before? We'll hang out, maybe. I really, I really like that. Person, we I think we'd have a good time. Who's that? Thanks for the drink. You're welcome. You have a a lovely day. You too. Yeah. <laughs> 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 and pretty well considering. All right, it's you know what? I mean, did it work? Oh, mate, mate, we're gonna yeah, yeah. All right, I'm, I'm going to bed now, everybody. Please excuse the noise. Yeah. All right, all right, let's go. So let's get a fucking drink, mate. Come on, celebration. Come on, you're. You all right? You okay? Can you go in? Can you go You all right? I couldn't hear that last part. I was having a problem with oh, my Oh, right, ears. right. I say, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go get a fucking drink. Let's celebrate. Come on. Probably, probably getting laid, mate. Probably. High possibility. Wonderful. You did nothing, but I appreciate you. I got that. Well, I wasn't really great at getting that guy Wait. out of there. No, but you did run distraction, though. You did run distraction. I do appreciate it. What's your poison there, mate? Uh, just cheap whiskey. All right, let's fucking get a drink. Let's this. this, 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 this. Am I, wait, am I buying or you? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I hate You're it. buying. You're the one. Yeah, all right, all right. Yeah. Getting whatever. That's fucking right, I am. Uh, wait a second. Now, if you need a wingman, you let me know, okay? Yeah, I'll. You be let me sure know. To call you. And I'll be there, mate. I'll be there for you. And, uh, I'll do you a solid. Alright? Just the way you, you did me a solid. Here, here's to, uh, here's to, uh, cheap Cheers. booze and, uh, uh first-time experienced wingman. What else? Oh, to you owing me a favor. Cheers. Uh, cheers. Ugh. All right. <laughs> yeah, why well, I fucking missed you, mate. Uh, fuck. Yeah, it's been a uh, well. It has uh, been an eventful, uh, eventful few months. Yeah, I've heard some. I've heard some fucking stories, mate. I've heard some fucking stories. You might want to elaborate. So I'm hearing this. I'm I'm hearing. I'm hearing that uh, Jack Kettleman. All right, he's going around. Stirring up all kinds of trouble, and then uh, the ranch is getting fucking railed because of it. Is that true? 
I think Jack Kettleman is stirring up a lot of trouble, yes. <laughs> but, I mean, that's the way it's always been. The ranch. The ranch. They... They, uh... I mean, yeah. They're loyal to him. They're loyal I, to I him. I have no clue why. Yeah, I'm, well, that's the whole fucking thing, in the Fucking... What were we saying? Todd, I can... Oh, you're right. Uh, Todd, I can... Understand. Yeah, Todd. He yeah, Todd. Todd's where like he's like he's uh he's he's been he's running the joint, you know. Suppose he is. He's certainly kept the cream flowing. Yeah, the cream's definitely been flowing. I uh, I gave some of uh, I gave some of the cream to uh, Ed the train lady. She loved it. Uh, that. <laughs> Don't yeah. get me started on Ed. Well, I tell you what, she's a fan. She's a fan. A Boyd Kara fan? <sighs> the what? A Boyd Kara fan? Kara fan? Oh, <laughs> see what you fucking did. Yeah, well, the thing is, she was calling it my cream. I had to correct her. That's my father's cream that she was she had on her lips. <laughs> Uh, just gotta get it right. I'm not really in the family business. That's the problem. Everyone just assumes, mm -hmm. you know, I'm a Kerrigan, therefore I'm part of the cream business, but I ain't. I'm my own man, right? I'm a handyman, nailing extraordinaire. I fuck nails. That sounds fucking painful. Uh, yeah, you know what I mean. I do know what you mean, but it conjured a mental image. Uh. Well... So, how are you finding a uh, handy manning? Is it all you'd hoped it would be? You know what? It's good money. I've made like uh, two thousand dollars in the last couple of days. Two thousand? I went into the wrong fucking profession. <laughs> well, you just got to use your brain, Kanikli. Your problem is you're hanging out with a fucking uh, a businessman that ain't really a businessman. He's what you call <laughs> a uh, what do you call it? What do you call it? Oh, he acts with his heart. No, no, not that. What, what, what do you call it? The thing. Uh. Come on. The tip you're your trying to get me to say halfway crook. I <laughs> yeah, wholly you disagree. Just fucking said oh, it. you motherfucker. If I wasn't said it, so. Mate. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, down that down. Yeah, fucking. There you go. Chuck a lug. Uh, from what I've seen in these past few days, yeah. there's nothing halfway about it. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, well, you're, well, why'd you fucking think of it then? The cat's fucking out of the bag. It's Everything's the about bag. to go to shit. It's out of the fucking bag. Oh, hey, fuck. hey. oh shit. Oh. Oh, you are. Uh... Oh. Yeah, I'm alright. Just need to, I'm just gonna get up here in a second. Hold on. Yeah, help me up. All right. All right. I'm ready. Here we go. All right. So, what do you got planned for today? Uh, I have a few things. Yeah. A lot of people want to kill us, so yeah. I've suspended most of my social appointments. Right, right. Well, you know what? You shouldn't let, you know, a little bit of, um, of, uh, danger get in the way of, uh, like, uh, recreational activities. You know? That's true. Yeah, you got, yeah, you got to get out there and you got to live your life. You're like, like a, like a pirate. You've already got the shirt down. Now you just need the, the, the mindset. As, uh, always had trouble taking what I want. Yeah, which is yeah, strange yeah. for a bank robber. Yeah, exactly. I mean, you, I, I, you, you're, you're just doing things that other people are doing. You gotta do things that you, you be doing. Yeah. Or you be doing things oh. that they be doing because what they do is not what you really want to do, but that's what you do because they're doing it. 
Yeah, that... Hmm. That makes sense. Yeah, exactly. Something to think about. <laughs> Fuck me, not a telegram yet. Me neither. Wait for a fucking telegram from the, this really saucy redhead. Fuck. Alright. All right. You... What? I don't realize that when I'm sober. Yeah, alright. Alright. No, uh, fuck it. Fuck it. You ever have a romantic relationship that lasts more than an evening? Uh, well... You see... I always got told that, you know, you shouldn't go out looking for love, right? That love will find you, right? So I thought, in the meantime, I'll just take what I can get, and then eventually, you know... You know, and, and, oh... Oh, wow. Yeah. Hey. I'm alright, I'm alright. I'm sober. Um... Yeah. Oh, shit. Nah. Nah, that's alright. Uh, we, we, I need it. We need. To, I need to go fucking work as well. I need to do. I got to go back to fucking Valentine. And you know, Valentine's a fucking termite infested shithole. Did you know that? Oh, I know it. Yeah, I, I got. I got a lot of work to do over there. I got a lot of hammering to do. What are you gonna be doing? You? Were you going to fucking kill someone? As you say. Rumors going around again about this jade mask. I'm going to try and find someone's telegram right now. All right. Wait. Do you have my telegram? No, I don't What's actually. Telegram? We What's just telegram? kind of run into each other on chance. All right, I'll give you my telegram, and you can telegram if you need anything. All right, and if you need all like right. the whole wingman thing, you let me know. Yeah, next guys, time I uh... guys help. Yeah. It's K Y. Oh, good, good letters. Yeah. Eight five six. I hope that's it. Was eight five seven? Oh shit! It's one of those. Eight five seven. Okay. Oh, wait, wait, I got my book. Hold on. Uh, it's eight five seven. <laughs> it's eight five seven. There you 857. go. Eight five seven. All right. There you go. All right. All right I'm gonna go hammer a nail, and uh, we yeah. Well yeah. Fuck. Uh, PB, can I get the dice roll on how long this is gonna take for me to sober up here? Take care. Yep, yep, yep. Bye, bye, mate. Watch out! Hey, cunt! <laughs> Bastard! Fucking Pepo emo, bro. <laughs> love the boy and Kenny Clo friendship, dude. I, yeah, it's so good. I love it. I love it so much, man. It's so good because when I played Baz, I didn't really have much of a, like an RP friendship with Kaniklo. And with Boyd, it's the opposite. Like me, like me and him are really close. It's, it's, it's awesome. I love it so much.
we gotta sober ourselves up. Uh, so before we work, we're gonna have to like, we're gonna have to have coffee, maybe dunk ahead in the fucking water barrel. Cause we can't work drunk. Is boy gonna gradually board? Uh, no. Uh, I won't rule it out, but I don't think so. Again, I just want to thank everyone for watching uh, the stream today so far. I'm not, I, it sounds like I'm ending. But I'm not ending. Uh, what's this song? All right. I just want to thank you guys for watching uh, because I know this is not your tradition. I mean, doing Civ streams is very different, especially for this channel. Um... And, and, and Boyd's a very slow burn character. Um, so I do appreciate everyone, you know, having the patience and enjoying the RP. Because uh, we are building a story here, uh, slowly but surely. Things are happening. Um, but it's it's much more... Um, um, what's the word? Hmm. I can't think of the right word, but... This is essentially like the season two of the Kerrigan story, like from Baz. This is, this is the season two. I am enjoying it. I am enjoying myself. The Kerrigan saga. Yeah. And I was very, I was very like iffy. On even doing Boyd. Like, I knew, like, the idea was there from even before I killed Baz. Uh, but I wasn't sure if it would, like, translate or if anyone would really be into it. And I was afraid that people would just see him as Baz. I'm sure there's people out there that do that haven't really watched that kind of just tune in for a minute and be like, oh, that's it's just Baz. It's not. He's not. Like, at all. His morals are very different. Um, his values are very different. Um... His goals are different. The only thing that's similar is, 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 is the voice. That's because I'm voicing him, obviously, and I can't really help but sound a little bit like Baz when I speak. Um, but he's, he's not Baz. But I think he's enough like Baz, like him being the son, he's enough like Baz that people that loved the Baz character... This is kind of like a good like outlet for, for you guys uh, to get like a continuation of that story, um, even without him. And there goes the entering town crash that happens. All right, I'm gonna relog. 120 people online. That's crazy, man. Not even not even peak hour yet. All right, let him back in. He's, uh, I think it was Jen. Jenny said that Boyd is like Baz. Baz has all his good qualities without, like, most of his bad ones. Which is kind of true. He has got his own problems. He's definitely got, like, an abandonment issue because he, he didn't have his father growing up and his mother... <laughs> was this song playing... I need, I need that for later. I need to save that for later. Oh, that's fucking good. Um, but you know, he's got, he's got that abandonment kind of issue growing up without, without his dad, uh, and his mother, you know, being with a lot of guys and not really settling down. Um, and then her dying while, uh, while he was over in Australia, 
So he's got like that that abandonment issue that he doesn't want to cling on to anything or any one person uh, because inevitably that person's going to leave him. So he's got that going, which is kind of his reasoning or the reason why he's the way he is with women. Uh, the reason why he, he kind of wants to be a deputy right now is that the Kerrigan name in Australia is actually known to be, like, hard workers and whatnot. Um, but over here, they're known as criminals. And he kind of wants to, he kind of wants to repair that. People in the bathhouse, which is good. Uh, fucking okay. We need to sober up. Howdy. Hey, g'day, g'day. Here uh, to smash some hands in with hammers. Not exactly what I'm here for, but I'm here to work. Is uh, the madam of the house around? Yes, that is I. No, that's no. You look you're... you look similar, but no, that you're not her. Is she around? Oh, uh, no, uh, she's currently. Oh, you you have to tell her, Tilly. Tell tell him. Well, tell him. Uh, she's dead. She... No, she's. She's not dead. She's just, she's just, uh, I think she's resting up. She's, uh, she got injured real bad. A uh, uh, grizzly bear uh, attacked, attacked us. Uh, so she's, yeah, she's probably going to need some rest for, for a little while. Oh, shit. All right. Um, okay. Well, if that's the case, uh, who do I speak to about, you know, doing some of the repair works? Uh, oh, that would be I. Oh, you're in charge. All right. Huh? Well, uh, first of all, I'm owed two hundred dollars for the the roofing repairs. Would you be able to cover that? Been fucking testic. That's no, mm -hmm. no, 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 no. It's two hundred, sir. So. Wait. You said 20, first of all. No, Second said, off, said what happened to the lady that paid you yesterday? Oh, uh, she got the money back. What do you mean she got the money back? She needed the money back, so I gave her the money back. So I'm still owed 200 Why? Because she's not the one that fucking owed me anyway. It's the owner well, of the establishment. she works for the bathhouse. All right, well, when well, you give me the $200, and then you can talk to the madam of the house, well, and she can I... give you $200 back. There you go. You can be reimbursed. I don't have the $200 to give you. Where Where's Christine? That's what That's I was what asking. Really That's what I was asking. Christine is resting okay, in Okay, where is she resting? In Strawberry? I'm gonna go right there and drag her out of her resting spot to pay this man. Oh, Sounds no, no. good. Sounds good to me. In the meantime, okay, um, did you want me to start some of the repair works or what? Yes. Can we get the bill written somewhere so that way I can give it to Christine so she can the take care of it? The bill for the fucking... I had it on the fucking counter here. Who took it? Yeah, I have no idea. There's oh, for fuck's sake, I gotta no write it back up again. All right, all right, let me just. I'm gonna go get myself a coffee. Uh huh. And then How I'll about that, uh, Mr. Repair Man? What's that? I give you a nice <laughs> bath and dance, and you cut some of the money off the bill. Mate, I'd probably end up charging more. I'm gonna go get a coffee and then uh, get Is some. Is that a test? No, it's not a fucking test. I will give you money if you I'm don't gonna... enjoy it. How about that, motherfucker? <laughs> no, no, I'm all right, mate. I'm going to go take... I'm going to go... By the way, looking good. I'm going to go get a coffee, and I'll... I'm going to get... Uh, I'll be back. I've had a few to drink. That's I'll 50 right. bucks off the bill for insulting the lady. If I took saying that she looks good? I'm kidding. I, I know nothing. It's Christine that does all that. But yes, the repair work can continue. Yeah, it was worth it anyway. Uh, uh, stunning. Thank you. Stunning. All right, I'm going to get coffee. I'll be right back. <laughs> oh, okay. What the fuck? All right, let's get a coffee.
Man, they're withholding pay, bro. What is going on here? Coffee. 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 Oh, pardon me, sir. What a dump. The whole place is a fucking dump. Did you give Ally the money back? Yeah, he gave her the 200 back after he won the, uh, we came second in the horse race. Like I said I was going to do. How is the Civ slog? It's not really a slog, man. It's, uh, very RP heavy. Which is cool. Much more like, uh, relationship building between characters. Is what I would, I would say it is. Uh, with, with the gang stuff, uh, as good as it is, it, you kind of limit yourself. You don't really interact with that many people. You, you interact with, like, your gang, and then, like, people you have in conflict with and stuff. Uh, but with the Civ uh, RP, you're interacting with a lot more people. Um, you get to see a lot more of the, of the world, which is cool. All right. Uh, okay. Um, let's get in the cover here and drink this I'll fucking coffee. Do you want anything, Lily? Um, that doctor gave me some, some morphine. Pill. Whiskey <laughs> coming up. Drink. There we go. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. Um, thank you. Mm -hmm. If you don't want it, I'll take it. Great. So, uh, you and Edgar are, uh... Um... This is where you finish the sentence. Um, oh, good, mm -hmm. good friends. Yeah. Good friends, okay. Yes. Uh. How you uh. doing today, uh, Mr. Builderman? I don't know your name, I'm sorry. Name's Boyd. Boyd. I yeah, like it. Me. Yeah. And what's your name? Scout. I was talking to her. Oh, oh, oh. uh... <laughs> Uh, my name is uh, Lily. Uh, Linwood. Lily. Yes. Yep. Well, ain't that a pretty name, huh? Well, thank you. Well, it's nice to meet you as well, Miss Mr. Boyd. Boyd, yeah, yeah. I don't think I've ever met a Lily before. No, oh, I I think there's uh I think there might be a few uh, Lilies here and there. It's a pop popular name after all. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a popular name where I come from, though. No? Oh. He's from Australia. They have ancient techniques. You're from Australia? For nailing That's and right. nails. I'm Aussie. Oh. Wow. Yeah. It's not real far away. Yeah, it's like on the other side of the fucking uh, the world there, yeah. Whoa. I travel a long way, but you know what? It was worth it. Wow. Uh. So what else needs fixing uh. to, today? Mate, look above your head. You see a fucking hole there? I know, the place is a dump. I know. I'm well, saying, what's next on your list? Well, we're gonna, we're gonna start repairing, uh... Well, honestly, I gotta do more of the fucking roof. Uh, I did most of it, uh, uh... But there's still some leakage happening, so we gotta get the roof sorted. Uh, and then we can get down here and get into the thick of things, but, um... Yeah, first things first, we're gonna start with the, the ceiling. And get that all all worked out. Uh, do you want to help or or nah? Sure, why not? All right, excellent. Uh, all right. Oh, um, uh, I think Miss Jack <sighs> mentioned something about a hole in, in the in the door. Uh, There's a hole in the door. You don't say. Where? Show me. Uh, I think it was. He said that somebody did a can can dance or something. All right, let's have a look. Uh, I think it was right here. Yeah. Ah, right here. So, yeah, you can see into the bath there. Right, right. Yeah. Okay, sweetheart. All right. Uh, tell you what. Here. Um, come here for a second. Oh, okay. Just, uh... I could probably just reuse this board here. We're just going to have to move it. So, could you just get to the other side of the wall and just push it? I push it back into place, and I'll uh, I'll just put a couple of nails in here, right? Uh, okay. All right. Uh, go, go, 
from the other, from the other yeah. side. Yeah, push, okay. push the panel, the plank of wood, push it back in, in the okay. place. You see that? Beautiful. Just, put, yep, yep, hold it there. All right, just hold it, hold it. All right, it's one. There's one more, sweetheart. Hold on. Uh, okay. All right. You're good. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. Oh, oh, sorry. Oh, oh sorry. <laughs> it's okay. Just a little bit of a mix up there. Oh, hey. That looks much better. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's completely repaired. Yeah. Hole in door. Oh, the oh, are you with the hole in the door repaired? Oh shit. Oh fuck. Okay, that's gonna be a little bit different. Oh. Uh, I thought you said the hole in the wall. The fuck. I was fixing the fucking hole that was here. There's oh, fucking holes everywhere. Oh All yeah, right. there's holes everywhere. Well, lucky for you, I can I can fix any hole, sweetheart. So what we're gonna do is we have to replace this whole fucking door. Oh, oh, shit. Oh. All right, that's fine. Oh, dear. Okay. All right, I'll, I'll get to it. I'll get to it. Oh, all right. Um, thank you, Mr. Yeah. Boyd. Yeah, yeah, of course. Hmm. Oh. I should leave a detail. Put a term my detail. <laughs> no, we'll save that. We'll save that. Joey's. <clears throat> All right. Well, I heard that. Unfortunately, mate, the uh, the door into the bath is is fucked. I'm gonna have to replace the whole fucking thing. Perfect. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm gonna have to go get myself a door. Come back. It's it's not a huge job, but it's a bit of a pain in the ass. All right. I'll just All add right. it to the bill. All right. Yep. Sounds great. Coming out of Christine's pockets, not mine, so. <laughs> Where am I gonna get a fucking door from? Let's go. Let's go to Rhodes. Let's go to Rhodes. Let's, let's find an excuse to go to Rhodes. Let's go to get a door in Rhodes. Because Rhodes is the door capital of the crossing. Just trolling her hotel. Mate. She's the one that asked me to survey the place, okay? She was inviting trouble. Lump it out in Blackwater? Yeah, but I was just in Blackwater. I don't want to go back. I want to go to a different place. Hold the line. Um... <laughs> I'll be right back, guys. I'm gonna go to the bathroom real quick.
to my stream now. Hi, chat. Where are we going? Ugh, he's going to Rhodes. <laughs> going to Rob Braithwaite Manor. Alright, I guess I'm leaving. You can't come over to the manor. I'm not. Because now I know you're coming and that's meta. But okay. you can't now. Okay. Huh? It's fine. <laughs> Ever. Ah. Alright, I'm back. <sighs> rain sniping? What's a rain sniping? That sounds painful. Get myself situated. Um, you need TeamSpeak for all Red M servers? I think so. I think so, yeah. I don't know. I don't play any other servers, but I think so. that use game chat god that sounds worse isn't like Mum mumbles the good one right i think i think eventually i think the server is eventually going to try and do mumble i think i don't know or an alternative because team speaks kind of prehistoric Almost there. We gotta get a fucking door. I got a feeling that all this stuff we're doing for the hotel, we're not gonna get paid for it, man. We'll sue. We'll take it to the sheriff's office. <laughs> we should make a contract for them to sign. Mumble isn't great. You've already been paid 2000 No, I haven't. I've got $2,000. They've paid me. I think they've paid me a hundred. A hotel. They paid me for the outside wall. Is what they paid me for. When crippling debt RP. <laughs> it's actually pretty funny. She should she should use it as motivation, like I'm 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 broke. We need to rob a bank. We need to get money. So we can pay for the repairs for the hotel. I think that'd be really cool. Give like RP reasons for doing crazy shit. It's a shame, shame that she's not around. She's injured. Hello! What are you doing now? We're gonna go to Rhodes. Pick up a, uh, a door. And head back. Uh... Wait, am I going the right way? I'm fucking confused. I've lost myself. This way. 
Um, and then we head back to Valentine. But we might stay here for a little bit first, depending if there's any RP. Someone just asked for help. No, he said hello. Just been putting too many people's feet in, there, in her mouth. Yeah, that's probably a problem. Doesn't make me want to tip at all. But I'm super glad they're doing the bathhouse stuff because it brings life. Um, to what would essentially be like a, a nothing, just a building to get clean. But it, now there's RP there, which is really cool. Waiting for Eliza to get here. When when Eliza's around, we get to do some uh, interesting uh, negotiations bullshit. Try and get things cleared up. Boys looking good. Thank you, dude. Winks, what are you doing? Excuse me. By a door off this NPC. Okay. G'day, mate. Uh, looking to buy a door. Got to replace a uh, door over in. Uh, in Valentine. And what, what did he say? Yeah, right. <laughs> we, when you want. Just fucking deliver the Valentine. Uh, drop it off there and I'll pick it up. Um, maybe like 40 minutes from now. All right. Appreciate it, mate. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'll, I'll pay you. Yeah, yeah, put the money on the fucking box. There you go. Uh, fuck. I need more cigarettes. I've looked at the Discord art section. Oh yeah, let me look at that now. That's sick. Those are really cool, man. That's so fucking cool. Bob, dude. Holy shit. Shout out to uh, Battle Babies. Uh, Join the Discord, guys, and check out the art section. That's really fucking cool. How do you do those things? I don't know. Is that like a program? Let's do that? Okay, we need cigarettes. These are different cigarettes. What's the difference between this cigarette? Snakeskin gold rolled cigarettes. How the fuck do you get those? I guess we'll just get normal cigarettes. Hero Forge. What's Hero Forge? Never heard of it. I met with step stepbrother yet? No, uh, Danny's not around. Oh, sorry, sorry, I get out your way. Yeah, you're right, mate. Oh, 
later, giving you half of the cash. I think that was Molly. Yeah. Does Boyden uh, know anything about Baz yet? Yeah, he knows quite a bit. He's kind of indifferent about the whole thing. Oh, sorry, I'm in your way again. Sorry. Are no, you right? He's kind of indifferent. Hey, how you doing? I'm good. How are you? Yeah, I'm right. Just doing some, uh, you know, carpentry stuff. Oh, okay. You hoping to find some work around here? I mean, uh, yeah, so I've I got to replace the door down in Valentine. I just ordered myself one. It's going to take a little bit of time to get down there. Uh, so I, I guess if there's anything around here for me to repair, I mean, I could do it while I'm here. Why, you got anything? Uh, uh, not me personally, but the people working at the gun shop might have some. All right, who runs the guns? Who runs that? Gr uh, if you approach her up there on the porch, mm -hmm. um, he's the one with the flat cap, green tight shirt. All right, yeah, okay, yeah, uh, I'll do that. He might have some for you. Uh, how are you doing, though? I'm doing really good, thank you. Oh, yeah? Um, just, uh, yeah, been writing and just enjoying my day. That's good. It sounds very relaxing. Yeah, yeah, it has been. When you uh, when you finish one of them books there, you let me know, yeah? <laughs> yeah, I'll do. I'll just hitch up. All right. Okay. Maybe get some work at the gun store. I don't know. Probably beats working for Christine, honestly. I don't think she's ever going to fucking pay me. Crouch running up the road right now. That guy that just oh, came that's, out. He's a dev. Oh, okay. G g'day. Uh, g'day, how g'day, doing, how sir? you doing? Uh, g'day. You're the owner of this establishment, sir? No, but I do work here. Do you need some? Uh, yeah, so... Essentially, I'm a... Uh, I'm a uh, handyman, carpenter, jack-of-all-trades, uh, nailing expert. And uh, no, I'm just going around uh, to businesses, no, seeing if there's any repair work to be done around uh, you know, people's buildings and such. I'm just wondering if you need any uh, any help or any work. Uh, we need anything repaired, Colin. Oh yeah. Um, not that I can think of. There are some fences around the uh, parlor house that need repair, though. Do you know the owner of the parlor house? Yeah, That's a man called Herbie. Yeah. Right, okay. I guess I'll go over there and uh, and see if uh, if there's Herbie fellows around. All right, appreciate yeah, it, sir. Okay. Yeah, well, no worries. Are you new to this place? Taking my job. Mm -hmm. uh, sort of. Around yeah. town? Yeah, yeah, sort of. Yeah. <laughs> all right. You all sorted? You, you good for, like, shit, you know? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm f well, I don't really use many, Probably so. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm yeah. good. Yeah. All right, well, nice to meet you. I'm Tara. I work here. You need any guns or cleaning or what? You uh, you can swing by. I will remember that. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. You want me to show you what I was talking about? Uh, sure. If, if you could link me to this Herbie fella, that'd be great. Yeah, let's see if he's around. And I'll show you the, uh, the fences. They're all fucked up. Pretty obvious. We got these here on the left. Hmm. I see, I see. Yeah, that's a problem. Missing some slats here. Yeah, yeah. Just uh, basic maintenance problems here. What'd you say your name was? Uh, Colin. What, what's your name? Name's Boyd. Nice to meet you, Boyd. Yeah, this is uh, a mess right here, too. All right. All right, I'll go, I'll go into the pile house, see if this Herbie fellow's around, and if he is, I can uh, get to work. Yeah, let's see if he's in here. Otherwise, just let him know I've been around, and uh, if he, you know, he can reach me. Did you uh, give Tar your telegram? Uh, no, but I can give it to you before I leave. Okay, yeah, I'll uh, pass that on to Herbie. We can go back this way. What's my charging? No fucking idea, man. Whatever I can get. Hey, Herbie! Get. Whatever I can get. Oh, shit. I guess he's uh, still sleeping or yeah, out getting fun. supplies or something. All right, that's not a problem. Okay, so my telegram is, uh, uh, are you ready? One second here. Yeah, go ahead. KY857. Yeah, 
And name's Boyd Kerrigan. Boyd Kerrigan. Okay, I got it. All I'll right. let him know, and then I'll send you a telegram, and uh, hopefully he sends you one as well. There's quite a mess out there to repair, so. Excellent. Excellent. Which means right. money for you. What's that? It means money for you as well. That's right. Lots that's of right. Work. Exactly. Uh, trust me, if there's anything going around the cross, and there's a lot of fucking uh, decrepit buildings and such, a lot of repair work to be done. Yep, I, I think the roof in this building is not doing too well either. Uh, People like to hang out up there. And, yeah, uh, yeah, I can definitely work that out. Roofs are one of my uh, fortes. Also, I have another thing that might be a project for you. Project? Yeah, this would be more of a... You might need more people to do it, but... Uh, a woman runs a cafe up here, Amber Sage. Uh-huh. And uh, right now you just have this um, lattice kind of covering the uh, the cafe out here. Okay. But I, what I was thinking is, you know, when it gets rainy, it would be nice if uh, there would be a cover up there in some oh, way to right, maybe right. pull it over when the rain starts. I don't yeah, know if that's yeah, something yeah. that... Yeah, that's yeah, something I can definitely do. I'm, like I said, I'm a handyman. Jack of all trades, something I can definitely conjure up there. All right, I'll uh, I'll write that down. I'll uh, I'll get back to you on that. I'm gonna actually gonna. You want me to check the uh, the store, the gun store roof, see if everything's up to snuff there. Eh, it might be a good idea. You don't want any leakage because leakage can cause uh, mass water damage. It gets in between the wall, right? You ever know you got a problem till it's there. Yep. Rot the wood, and then all of a sudden the building's falling apart. That's right. That's right. So I'll just jump up there, have a quick fucking geese at it, and uh, see what we're working with here. Sounds good, Boyd. What's this guy's name again? All right. You should be able to get there. Uh, yeah, these these boxes should should help you. Yeah, not a problem. Yeah. All right. Oh, I see. Okay. Uh, getting gradually more and more. It looks like some there's some warping on this side down here. Alright. Maybe not. Um Yeah, no, it's just getting Oh, um, busy. don't look at me. <laughs> uh, I just slipped. It's alright. You got some Oh, oh you tripped over a hole there. Yeah, there a, is a, a hole right a, there. A tar. Yeah, yeah, where are you? I can hear you. Yeah, come to the you. front here, mate. Where is he? Roof. It's up here. Oh, fuck. Yeah, hell. we're up on the roof. All right, so I'm, yeah, I'm just investigating well. yeah, the, uh, well, the the shingles <laughs> here. You've got some you got some missing shingles, mate. You're going to get some water damage if you don't settle this shit. Oh, yeah? All right. How yeah. much is that going to set me back? Well, mate, it's, uh, it's going to really depend on how much uh, shingles are going for, but I can get the uh, the supplies and the, the, the materials and... Plus the man labor and uh, and all that. I could probably get it done for you for a decent price. Um, right, give me a quote. I'll give you, you a come quote. Back and give me a quote. I'll give you a quote, mate. Give me give me like ten minutes, yeah. All right. The tiles are forty dollars. Hey, look on that side on the left. It looks like the shingles are starting to warp. Yeah, there. right here in the corner. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, and over here too. You see this up here? Along yep. the uh, along the the edge there. Yeah. All right. That's yeah, not good. Not good at all, but we'll get it sorted. Don't worry about that. Oh, oh that was a drop. G'day, mate. Yep. Everything okay? Oh, yeah, we're just, uh, he was just doing some roof inspection. Ah, okay, good. Oh, is this the roofer that's, uh... Different people. All right, mate, gonna need some fucking shingles. How much is that gonna set yeah, me back? Yeah. Forty dollars. All right, forty dollars for the fucking shingles. All right, let me just do the paperwork here. Let's have a look. All right, let's write this down. Forty dollars for shingles. Oh, man, labor hours. How much, guys? How much is fair? Like eighty bucks? Fifty? Sixty dollars? Sixty dollars? Fifty dollars? Sixty. 60 bucks. 60 dollars, okay. 
I can get a hundred. I can get a hundred. Hey, Tor! Come over here, mate. Paying this shit, Cooper should really, I suppose. Right, so yeah, I was just talking to this fella here about uh, getting the uh, the shingles over. Uh, so the shingles is going to set you back about $50. Uh, then uh, the manual... Shingles are $10 a box, I think. No, they're $10 each. The man over there said they were $10 a box, didn't Who, he? What did he say? Wait, is, is, who's, who's the fucking the shingle expert? That's your competition that... over there. He's a roofer, a carpenter, that man on the fucking thing there. Okay, I'll tell you what that guy's going to do. With the grain. That, that, that guy's <laughs> what he's going to do is going to do a fucking shit job, right? It's going to be fucking damaged within a couple of weeks. You have to hire him again. And then you're going to hire him again. He's going to bleed you uh -huh. for every fucking penny you got. Me, I do one fucking deal, and by the time you're dead, it's still going to be good. All right, okay. Yeah, if you say so, I don't know shit about this stuff. All right, All right so... so that's $50 for the shingles themselves, though. How much of fucking... Uh, you what know, do you do? Glue them on there? What's that? Now I'm going to nail it on. I'm a nailing expert. Nailing is what I do. Nailing is my profession. So I'm going to nail the fuckers. Uh, it's going to cost about $25 labor. So that's 50, 60, 75 dollars. I'll get to work right now and get that sorted for you. 75 dollars. We got 75 dollars in the fucking kitty. Colin. Yeah, yeah. Hold on a second. I'll go get some and I'll be right back. All right. Excellent. I got a. Uh, you know what? I'll get. Yeah, I'll get half. Yep. I'll go fucking. Uh, there you go. Look at that. See, solid work. Yeah. Um. That's actually work that's needed, right? Who the fuck do you think I am? I'm just making sure there's a lot of people going through that don't do All legitimate right. business. You got binoculars? Yeah. Look up near the fucking you chimney there. I do. Yeah, look up at the fucking chimney. Come over okay. here. Come here. Get a better view over here. Look at this. Come here. All right. If you look... Near the chimney, down the, the edge of the roof, you see the fucking deformity? Oh, yeah, I do see that, actually. Mm -hmm. That's rain damage. Hail damage. All right? That's been... Uh, uh, that's that's warpization. All right? That's going to be a problem. Warpization, okay. That's right. It's what happens when the... Uh, the uh, condensation of the... Uh, the water... Gets into the the tilings and it, it can cause a warp. You see, because when the wood gets wet, it becomes flexible, right? And then it dries up, and that's where you get the warp action. I see. That's right. That's right. But we're gonna um, we're gonna get that sorted quick, smart. Don't you worry about that. Well, uh, I'll be on the job, um, and I'll, we'll get it all fixed up, and everyone's gonna be fucking happy. There you go. Here's eighty. We're gonna give you some extra. You know what? I appreciate the tip, fella. Thank you very much. Much obliged. You're welcome. We appreciate your work. Oh, excellent. Uh, does anyone want to... Do you have anyone that want to jump up here and hold the nails for me? How about you, Ty? You're a, you, you look like a strapping uh, young lad. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Yeah, yeah, come here. Come here. Sure. I mean, I'm not that good at this kind of stuff. Yeah, bro. yeah, yeah. yeah. No, don't worry about that, mate. We got you. Never really worked on stuff like that. Nah, just, you just got to hold the nail for me. You're going to be fine. Yeah, all right. Okay. Up here. Hey, you know Eliza? I do. Yeah. Is she doing all right? Yeah, she's all right. Yeah, tell her to swing by at some point. I haven't seen her in a bit. All right, take this. Okay. All right, so what we're going to do is... It's pretty simple stuff, all right? Now, we're going to do the old uh, ancient Australian two-handed hammer technique. You heard of it? Two-headed hammer? Two handed, hand handed, handed the hammer The two-handed hammer. Yeah, that's right. So yeah, what we're going to do is... Uh, you're going oh to gonna hold the nail, right? Okay. I'm going to grip the shaft with two hands. I'm going to count to three, and when I say three, you let go of the fucking nail. I'm going to drive the fucker right into the shingle. Oh, fuck me. All right. All right. I'm going to start right here. Come close. Right here. Oh, my God. Get real close to the edge. Come on. Get real tight. All right. Hold the nail. Now, the, the secret is, there's a couple secrets. First secret is, you got to be steady. You start shaking, I'm going to fucking 
squash your finger. All right. Gotta keep it still and steady. Uh, now, when I say three, you fucking move it. All right. Okay. All right. You ready? Yeah. One. Two. Three. Oh, beautiful. Yeah, you see that? Yeah, it was Simple. pretty, pretty close. Pretty close, but little, perfect. Little too, little too close. Move over here. Perfect, really. Okay. Next, next now, Lynn. Okay. Same thing. One, yeah. two, oh, God. Yeah. three. Whoa. Hey, oh my God! <laughs> Even closer. You're yeah, getting... well, you gotta speed up, then, don't you? Yeah, that's right. Back. Yeah, right well. Okay. Get right in the fucking crevice there. Right in the fuck. No, get over here. Over here. Get in. Get in there. Get in there tight. Okay, I don't want to fall off this fucking thing. I don't right. like buildings. Yeah, well, you have to maintain, son. You have to maintain. Okay, one, two, three. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, you must have felt that breeze, huh? I feel like you were aiming for my hand that time. Yeah, don't worry. No, of course not. Of course not. All right, on this side. All right, just uh, pass me. Uh, over by the, the, the plank over there. Uh, I left the, the box of shingles. Grab the uh, the peak part. Like it's, it's, it's shaped like a like a V. That's for the, the very peak. Grab a couple of those. This one? This fucking thing? That's the one. Okay, and we're going to lay it in here. Now, this way we don't have to do the two-hand technique. I'm just going to tap it into place there. So just put it right on the, the, the end there. Beautiful. Just hold it okay. there. Yeah. Doesn't seem so hard, really. Well, you know, it's it's you know, mate. Have you held held a hammer before? How's it going I mean, over there? Yeah, I held a hammer. Uh, you know what? A coffee would be nice, mate. Yeah, two oh, yeah. sugars in mine, stirred anti-clockwise. Yeah, three in mine, counterclockwise. Because I'm it. sweeter and better looking. All right, next shingle. Anti-clockwise and counterclockwise are the same thing. Don't be a smart ass, mate. No one likes a smart ass. But we just ass. say anti clockwise in Ireland. I know, and, yeah, you're one of them you know. poms, I know. Oh, I think there's English people in there. Yeah, the English, Irish, Scottish, all the same fucking thing. Put the fucking oh, shingle right. down, you're will you? You're a Kiwi, you must be a Kiwi then. Yeah, I'm one of those. Put the fucking shingle down, will you? All right, there you go. Worrying too much about where I'm from and not much of it about your fucking building. That's why it's so oh. fucking decrepit up here. I don't care where you're from. There you go. Okay, just move it to the right there, mate. All right, last one down. Put it in there. Okay, like this. Yeah, I'll do. All right. How's the queen doing? Uh, we got a king. Queen, king, same fucking thing. The queen thing. of England. I think she's fucking dead, mate. How would I fucking know that? Well, how would I know? I'm not from England. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right. Okay, a couple more. Uh, this is the we're going back to the one shots now. Oh God! All, All right. right, get right and right, right in there. Get real tight, real tight. Okay. All right. You ready? Yeah. All right. One, two, three. Whoa! Damn. Good. I'm sure you're aiming for my hands. I ain't I fucking aiming way. for you, mate. You're starting to get the shakes. You're starting to make me nervous. Hang on, fucking shaking. stop shaking. Hang on. I'm shaking. I don't know. All right. Where do you want me to sit your coffees? Hey! Who's that? Hey, there she is. You got problems with these people? Nah. Ah. Look who it be, <laughs> huh? Here to our... Sure. I'll be right. I'll be right down there with a second. Love, I'm just gonna finish off this fucking roof. All right. Uh, okay. All right. Two all right. sugars, anti-clockwise. There you go. And I'll be right back hunger. with the other. All right. Don't drink that fucking coffee, mate. You gotta finish the fucking job, mate. The sun's going down. Um. I mean, um, we're just gonna finish this coffee first, and then. I mean, we could grab one of these. Other Typical Palmer. Got to have your little tea break. I understand. Who wants to come up? It's coffee. Who Typical wants to come up here? Soft as piss. Help this uh, New Zealander with his thing. Oh, there you go. Colin can do it. Colin. All right, fantastic. Yeah, yeah. You want to come hold this fucking nail for me, mate? Yeah, let me just sit down your coffee here. Yeah, just put it down the fucking ground. 
All right, what do you need? All right. We're doing the uh, the the ancient Aussie two-handed hammer technique. So I need you to hold the nail down. I'm going to fuck it up with two hands on the hammer. You got to move the last second, okay? Hold it steady. Hold the nail. Okay. The, 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 key, the key is don't shake. All right? Okay. Don't blink or you'll die. Is that right? Ooh. That's right. You're going to say, tell me when, or are you going to count One. down or something? I hate that. Let's end. Two. Three. Oh. Okay. Oh, oh you were right. Uh, uh, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, 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 you were fucking shaking, mate. What the fuck was that? Yeah, what uh, the fuck? Uh, you know, it's just, uh, wasn't sure what was going to happen there. I had better reactions than that. Fucking hell. Fuck. All right. How many counted did you in? I counted you in and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just, okay. you, you kind of froze. You, you froze. Kind of crazy technique as well, you know. Okay, get, get over it's here. anticipation, you know. All right, Ty, you're going to have to hold the fucking now. This guy is... Uh... Yeah, he's going to have to... He's got the you, shakes. You broken your finger or what? No, it's fine. He's fine. I didn't hit him that hard. All right, ready? One. Yeah. Two. Three. Ah! Oh, oh, <laughs> Oh, ooh, uh, that was ooh. a good one. That was a good one. <laughs> yeah, it's all right. You know, a little bit of uh, finger crust never hurt anybody. Ooh, 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 ooh. All right, that's the roof. You're right. You good? Yeah, yeah. <sighs> that'll do it. That'll wake up in the morning. All right, where's that coffee? Yeah, over here. Here you go. Fucking hell. <sighs> <laughs> Three sugars counterclockwise. Beautiful. Beautiful. And trigger finger. Yeah. Uh, Ow. You good? Is it bleeding? No. Oh, you're not That's even wearing gloves. Jesus. It's probably broken, but. <sighs> See, the thing that saved me was were my gloves. I mean. I get the feeling that maybe he don't care about the shingles. I think he just wants to hit people's hands. Sure, he's a Kerrigan. Maybe he's one of their fucking mama's boys. <sighs> hitting people hammers. Staring I don't know. He's drinking so loud. Do you hear that breathing? Yes. It's actually. Well, probably gonna get down off the roof before we yeah, get to the Yeah, yeah, it's got the roof. In. Yeah, that's fine. All right, let's get out of here. <sighs> it's good. Did the nail did the nailing sound effects sound good on your end, guys? Hopefully it did. Okay. Yeah, he got me too, but uh, uh it'll be fine. Hey, Ed, how you doing? Hi, how are you? Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Uh, not working today, huh? Uh, nope, not. Well, I mean, I. You never know. But right, right, right. now, I'm not. Oh, okay, you want to uh, go for a little, you know, a little uh, ride? I'm going down to Valentine to do some work. You want to? You want to come with, or you? You busy? Oh, well, you. You could take her on a date. I mean, yeah, okay. but I, I, I gotta repair a, a fucking obvious. door first. I've ordered the fucking door. Clearly. The door's being delivered. No, no, it's okay. I'm going. You can go with me. Oh, fantastic! You want you want to ride with me? Oh wow! Sure. Excellent. All right. What is? What, what are you gonna do with the door? You the peanut gallery? Mate, mate I'm uh, gonna replace it with a fucking door. It's broken, uh, obviously. And which door is yours? You're gonna, you close it. You're gonna nail. Mine is the, the car at the end. Oh, okay. Let me just, um... Got a Valentine for some nailing. Hey. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Wait. Hey. Hey. You, hey, you be careful with him. What's she doing? Hey. That's, hey. Hey. That's my horse. She's, 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 she's just put it in the stable. It's all right. It's all right. Come on. Jump uh, up. Uh -huh. I got you. Uh, okay. Hit. All right. Okay. There we go. All right. I have avoided. very little arm strength. That's all right. You don't need arm strength. You're a woman. <laughs> Later. 
Good luck in Valentine. Aha. <laughs> uh -huh. Used to be a fighter, you know. Yeah, yeah, it's good. Uh, so we're, I've ordered a door. There's a door that's damaged down in. Fuck's this horse's problem. See, look Hello. At my horse thinks he's so beautiful and was looking back to look at you. Look at that. I, huh? I may have oatmeal in my pockets. That, that, yeah, it's probably that. Yeah. Well, not. Okay, not. Sorry, oatmeal. My girlfriend cookies, just got so just pissed. Oatmeal. It's a joke. <laughs> it's not just oatmeal in my pockets. Oh, yeah. I, yeah, well, you know, I know all about that. <laughs> That'd be very strange to have just oatmeal. Yeah. Yeah, that would be a little strange. In my pocket. But yeah, there's a, there's a door that's been damaged down in the uh, the bathhouse down in Valentine's. So we're going to go there. I'm going to replace the fucking door. And uh, once I replace the door, you know, we can uh, maybe, uh, you know, you know. Also, I didn't I didn't know that Molly was your aunt. My what? Your aunt. She said she, you'll, she's like your aunt. She said that. Yeah. Well, that's not true, but all right. Oh. Interesting. So how are you doing? Huh, honestly, I could be better. I keep finding out more bad things. Like what? I, I don't... I feel like it's bad to talk about past things here at this certain time. You alright? Oh, yeah, I'm fine. It's just, you know, things that'll get better over time. You know, you can talk to me, right? Yeah, I just, it's awkward because it's, you know, I. It's, okay, fine. So that deputy that I went on a date on a while ago, turns out he was seeing lots of people. What an asshole. Yeah, I, I, I like, uh, you know, being one on one with someone, you know, after the weird relationship I was in a while ago. Right, right. You're just looking for, like, uh, someone that's going to be just with you, right? Yeah. I'm fucked. I feel bad now. Well, you know, um... You seem... You're a lovely, lovely woman. You know that? I appreciate that. <laughs> what do I do from here? Um... So what about this other fella that was uh, spoken of, huh? Marty. Yeah. That's a whole nother can of worms. So I tried to, uh, you know, I, I just wanted to ask Marty out for a cup of coffee, right? And I, I don't really reach out to people that much. It, it's kind of nerve wracking for me. And uh, she, uh, well, <laughs> Pavis, you know Pavis? Uh, can't say I do. Deputy Pavis. Uh, sh she was at the sheriff's office, and I asked for her um, advice, it, like girl advice, because, you know, I don't do this often. And I was like, I, I really want to ask this guy out. You know, I, I don't know how to do it. I, I don't know how to talk to guys. And she said, you should just go for it, Ed. Just do it. You know, what's the worst that could happen? So I said, you're right. It's a great idea. So I got the carriage to uh, ask him out, and he uh, he said, "Well, if you would have asked me not too long ago, I would have said yes." But uh, somebody else already asked me, and it turns out it was Paris. Oh, she was playing a, a joke. She, so she just kind of set me up for a failure. I'm not very good at this whole dating thing. What a bitch! It's kind of bad luck. Well, um, I'm, s I'm s sorry to hear that. Her voice isn't cringy, dude. She's got a great <sighs> voice. Leave her alone. It happens. Um, but, you know, I move on. Yeah, well, it so sounds like you have. Yeah, I, I kind of gave Snow only one chance and, uh...
G'day, what's going on? Australia. G'day, g'day. Yeah, I'm back. Oh, I thought one of them was. Uh, well, welcome back, mate. How was a uh, how was the trip back? Uh, long, real long. Yeah, I bet it was. I, 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 I hesitate to ask this. Hmm. But obviously, knowing the reason why you went back home, is everything all right back uh, home? Or? Uh, yeah, she died, mate. She was dead by the time I got back. Oh, fuck, mate. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, you know, it happens. Circle life and all that, yeah. Yeah, well, you're not wrong. You're not wrong there. Well, I'm glad you're back. We, we were up to you looking after the ranch or something? You doing a bit of work? Uh, just doing some, you know, odd jobs here and there, working yeah. Valentine, roads, you know. Well, what's all going right, on with you? Enough. Oh, not much, mate. Not much. Just out doing a bit of fucking buffalo hunting myself, you know. Oh, yeah. I, I, I stay in St. Denis too long. I go fucking mental, so it's nice to get out under the sun every now and again. Yeah, of course. This is, uh, this is, this is, this is Ed. Lovely lady. Nice to meet you, Ed. My name's Solomon. Solomon? That's right. Hello, B. All right there. How you doing? Yeah, we are just on a little bit I'm of, good. uh, you know, we, we went to see a moving picture. Oh, yeah, it's yeah, nice. they're great, aren't they? Oh no, yeah, That's we saw cool. we saw a brain explosion. It was great. Was that the name of the, the moving picture? Or? Yes, yeah. Yeah, I thought it was scary, but it was about a big big man. Yeah, drinking clam oh, right. juice. Yeah. Yeah, the one I always remember is the one about uh was it? It's like is the someone's having an affair and then someone gets shocked because they think they're a ghost. I can't remember. it's very it's very Is odd that the one where the lady loses her head? Uh maybe. It might, might be. have to I check think... that one out. I think we might we might look at that one next. What do you think? Yeah, there's a good yeah, one. It's, it's, yeah, I won't, I won't give it all away, but I, I, I've seen it three or four times now. Yeah, don't ruin it. Don't ruin it. No, I'm not going to. I'm, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not, not giving it away. I'm just saying it's good. That's all. All right, all right. Well, um, okay, we got things to do, but I, good to see you again. Yeah, you too, mate. You look after yeah, yourself. Yeah, you too. Nice to meet you. You too. Look after him. <laughs> look after him. <laughs> <sighs> nice day out in the prairie. It is a nice day out in the Me prairie. Me not having to work today. Yeah, you not getting no robbed. No Diego. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, but the fucking guy trying to besmirch me. Yeah, I remember him. We got in a fight. Well, you probably should. He's a bit of a dickhead. And he tends to overstep his bounds sometimes. Yeah, did you put him in his place? I mean, I tried, but he's one of those people. Right, right. Doesn't like authority. He's doing or... his job, so it, at least he's doing his job. That's all I care about. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Maybe he's one of the ones that'll place Mose, replace the... me someday. Thank you for the sub, dude. I'm sorry it took so long to get to that. Appreciate the sub. So are you working tomorrow or what like what's uh, what's the schedule looking like? Ah uh, no, probably not tomorrow. So uh I mean if the if the interview thing doesn't go well, I could always maybe apply to do some security work on the on the train, you know? Yeah. I'd be happy to interview you. I am? Yeah. Is there any way I can pay you under the table? Uh, no. What about over the table? Uh, no. <laughs> yeah, no it was, you can't, it was, it was, you can't pay it was, it me was, was over a, the table, under the table, around the table. It was, it was a joke. Roll the table. It was, it was a, yeah, okay. Anyway, right over your head. Uh -huh. Oh. Hello, dear. G'day. Hello. I like her hair. Very large hair. Yeah. I'm gonna do it on you. Do what? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna ride next to the track, okay? Mm -hmm. All right. Until if you touch get... the tracks, I will go off like some kind of alarm. Ah! I jumped. I jumped. Where well, are I supposed to get to fucking walls? I'm gonna go the, what, the long route. Come on now. Uh, well, we got we got a uh, decision to make here. Uh huh. I'm making it for us. 
okay? Uh-huh. We're going okay. on the fucking track. Ah! <laughs> yeah, you can't hey! keep you can't keep that up for Get long. Get off the track! Nope. Nope. You ain't working. You got no authority ah! here. You got no authority. I have every authority. Yeah, when you've got I have your uniform all the, on. I am the head conductor. When you've got your uniform on, yeah, but when you don't, you oh, know who you are, okay. you're just another uh -huh. civilian. Wow, just, just like another me. civilian. I'm way more important than that. Yeah, sure, when you got the uniform on. Sure. I really hope you get hit by a train. What? I, I, that's all I can think of when people ride on the track is I hope you, you get hit by a train. You want to be hit by a train, really? Is, uh -huh. that what you, is that what you really want? Yep. Okay, don't jump off the tracks now, but uh, maybe after we get off the bridge. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. I don't want you to actually get hit by a train, Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah, I knew it. <laughs> <laughs> you know, people think I'm one of the Chichenzos because of that laugh. Is that what it is? Uh, uh, I don't think I've met him. They, uh, they're, they're insane and they, they're a big gang of assholes. Oh, right, right. They robbed me once to pay me. There's a wagon. Oh, fancy. Oh, that looks like no good. Yeah, up to no good, probably. Here we are. Thank you. I, I had a really great time. Well, I had a great time too. It was a, it was very enjoyable. I, I hope we can do this again. I think we will. I think we will. Um. Oh, uh, <laughs> she was up there. She. I see you. See you soon. Good night. Have a good time. <laughs> uh, uh, fuck me, dude. All right, let's go. Something that ain't said.
That's ridiculous. What the fuck, man? Uh, what do you, what do you guys think of Ed? <laughs> oh man, uh, <laughs> interesting, interesting. That change that might change things. What do you want this to be about? Well, I want you to, to surprise me. Show me your talent. You got some of it on top of your own head. Then I'll break her heart. I know, man. Tonight, I know. I am a deer. What about Saf? Oh, fuck, do I? Fuck. The hunter that tried to hurt me hit his head on a tree. <laughs> I'm so happy. Me and my little <laughs> We're not doing no polls, man. That's mean, okay? They're not objects. Okay? I tell you what, though. We've got Team Ed and Team Saf. Great. You know what? Very close. There would have been a team uh, Adelaide, but who wants to deal with Tommy well, I'll let Two you Snakes? Know when I get uh, my production going. <sighs> um, I could play the banjo too. Very good. I'm multi talented. Do you, you want to do a thruple? <laughs> yeah, for some reason I don't mm -hmm. think At least Saf you would be you should see into the that. I guess I should. Uh, yeah, sounds like a good idea. Yeah, probably. Anyways, have a good one. Actually, I should yeah, probably bank. Too. I got 86 bucks on me. Let me... Let me bank that. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Let me just fix my fan. One second. Better. Okay. You're honest with Ed? So that makes it obvious. Yeah, him sharing that with Ed was pretty big. And I don't know why. It just, it kind of just happened naturally because the, just the way that the character is, she's, I don't know. She's just someone that my character just felt comfortable saying that to. He's obviously been holding that in for a while, you know? So that was cool. Like that was just... The way he's, even the way that I, I, I put it forward was him just vomiting out, obviously, something that he's been, you know, keeping in. And I think he, I tell you what, I think he did it. And this is, this, well, I know why he did it. But I think the way that I wanted to, to be portrayed is that he said it in such a, in such a nonchalant way. Because he want he kind of likes her. And he just wanted to get it all out there and just see if she would just run away from him. But she didn't. Oh boy, we got fucking oh God, we made, we got decisions to make, dude. We got we got some uh, tangled webs we weave, man. We got we got we got that whole thing. We got the we got the SAF thing. We got the law interview. We got this thing happening, dude. We got some fucking story going on. Uh, we got to go out west. Hopefully, Eliza's around. If we don't, if we don't become law, we could do train security, which would be interesting. Deal with train robberies. That'd be, that'd be kind of sick.
You're not any sooner, are you? No, 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 no. We're just going for a little bit longer. I had that coffee and it's kind of, it's given me a second wind. Even though I haven't been shrimp for that long, um, I haven't had much sleep neither, so. What did he say to Ed? Uh, he basically just told her that he's a kind of a man whore. <laughs> Essentially, is, is, is the gist of it. Do the law interview? I, you ca I can't do that now. I gotta wait for, uh, for them to tell me when to do that. I don't control that. All right, we're gonna head. I'm gonna head. Oops, we're gonna head out west to Riggs. Check out telegrams there, and then head to the ranch, and uh, then out west. Uh, depending if the ranch folk are around, we'll check that. Because we into we're getting to like the peak hours now, so we should start seeing some of the uh, the ranch uh, characters around, which would be cool. Uh, <clears throat> train security wouldn't work. Wallaby is the biggest train robber that would make the job. I Okay, I'll tell you this. I'll be honest with you. Uh, Wallaby was very active with the train robberies. Um, but then the train started getting robbed, like, daily by a bunch of other gangs. Uh, so me and, uh, and the rest of the group kind of decided that we didn't want to... We didn't want to um, just pile on to the trains because they're already getting, you know, robbed constantly. So that's why we stopped robbing trains. Uh, even though I love trains, man. I, I, I enjoy doing trains way more than banks. Um, but, you know, they're, they're getting robbed like two times a fucking day, man. It's like, yeah, you don't want to pile onto that shit. So we decided not to do any more trains, unfortunately, because I love them so much. And Ed is one of my favorite characters to rob. Uh, you should do a lot more with Boyd. He's a great character. Thank you. I appreciate that. Uh, that and Missy scared of trains. Yeah, that too. Yeah. But no other group can make a train conductor have a nervous breakdown from a whistle. Uh, I was so, so fine when she brought that up. That was pretty funny. I like that. Team Adelaide. Oh god, here we go. The thing is, I've kind of dug myself a hole because they're all great fucking characters that I want to interact with. But I guess the juggling and the just the predicament that we put ourselves in is kind of... That's, that's the roleplay, right? How do we roleplay around this? That's what's interesting about it. It's great seeing you and Nia RP with each other. Yeah, we, we've never had that much RP time. When I was Baz, she was doing a lot of Moxie. And, um... I never really got to interact with Moxie much. I think I interacted with her once as Baz, like a one-on-one -on -one interaction up in uh, the mines off stream. Uh, so I didn't get much interaction with her. That was pretty much it. And then Ed, I've had some interaction with her as the Wallaby Kid, but it's like the first time I've uh, got to actually RP with her, like alongside her. And uh, it was really fun. That rooftop scene was so much like the famous Baz and Riggs screenshot. Oh uh, yeah, I purposely, yeah, I, I lined that up purposely. Thank you. So you're going to Rhodes. Oh, well, yeah. Too late now. We've committed. If we don't have any telegrams, um, I, if there's no one at the ranch and there's no telegrams, then we can maybe go back to Rhodes. Team single forever. Yeah, that's pretty much what I was before. Well, I still am. They're not officially a couple. They're not officially a couple. Team Saffron, she's Scottish, and I fucking love it. Yeah, she's great too, man. I mean, I'm... F the thing is, though, how would Saff react to what, uh, what Boyd told Ed? Would she be as accepting and... I don't know. It's hard to tell. 
We're in a predicament. We're in a bit of a predicament. But it's fine. This is game interesting. Okay. Son of a bitch. Okay. Test it. And what if she accepts it? Then what? Where do I go from there, man? Anyway, let's let's uh, we'll just see what happens. Yeah, you know, we'll let it, we'll let the RP dictate. We'll go along with it. We're not doing no fucking polls, okay? Because I I don't want like any of them to watch this vod back and see a fucking poll. It's no, it's not it's not good, man. That's not a good thing to do. We're not doing no fucking polls. No. And choose which one has the best hips. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> Who has the better hips? Okay. Damn it, guys. God fucking damn it. Let me put some music on. Hold on. <laughs> uh, you guys. You fucking guys. No, that's way too intense. Way too intense. Oh. Oh, we'll just play this. Classic. Imported Rena, dude, you nailed it, by the way. You nailed it. Well done. H hats off. Well done. Hey, uh, hey, Po, uh, <sighs> fuck. <sighs> 
So, uh... It's, uh... Ah, oh, fuck it. I, um... I put an application for law. And, uh... Got past the... You know, the written... Uh, application. I gotta do an interview next, and, uh... I know... You wanted to be law, I'm... I got told by Barkley. So maybe I can do something that you wanted to do. Maybe help some people. You know? Um, yeah, there's some fucking shit happening out here at the ranch. I don't know. I guess you're watching. But, uh... Uh, I don't want to get too involved in the whole thing. It seems like a fucking mess, you ask me. You really know how to pick your fucking mates. I tell you what, that Jack Kettleman fella, he's a fucking psycho. From everything I've heard and seen. Causing all kinds of fucking mischief and... Everyone here seems to be suffering. So I, uh... I'm gonna try to help where I can, but I don't want to, like... Piss anybody off, you know? A little awkward. Um, you know, sometimes I sit here and I think, you know, what would you say and do? But the problem is, I don't even know what you're fucking sounding like. Um, I'm gonna try and, uh, you know. Raise the, the, you know, the name up again. Uh, so we're not just remembered as, uh, as bad folk. It was everything I heard. It sounds like you had the best intentions, but you didn't always go about it the right way, you know? What the details say? Uh, Australian war medal with blue ribbon. Uh, Boyd brought that over from Australia. A uh, bowl of Irish whiskey and a drawing of diamonds. Bowl of Irish whiskey uh, left out. Yeah. Eliza? Please tell me it's her. Yeah, it is, thank fuck. Perfect. Hey! How you doing? How you doing? I'm alright, I mean, don't mind me, I didn't want to interrupt uh, you. Nah, I was just, I was just about to leave. Uh, did you get my telegram? I did, I actually just wrote back to you. What's this about? Uh... I just, uh... Let me just ride with you. Okay, where are we going? Yeah, just 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 around. All right. Uh, so last night I uh spent some time here. And I did some repair work on the porch, and uh, I was talking to some <sighs> of the what? No, thank you for that. I was about to say thank you. I just 
fucking porch has been in disarray for weeks now. It's just the last thing on my mind, honestly. It's just nice that somebody took care of it. Yeah, yeah, that's not a problem. That's what I do, right? I'm a nail expert, uh... but, um... I was talking to some of the ranch hands and, uh, you know, just getting, I guess, the vibe of the place, you know? Yeah. And, uh, you got a lot of people here, a lot of folk that, uh, they're not, they're not fighters or, or killers or, and they don't want to be any part of what's been going on. Right? And, um, <clears throat> I also spoke to Todd, and he seems hell-bent on, you know, doing what's been doing. Uh, I then spoke to his wife, and she seemed very... ...concerned about the whole thing. Really? Yeah. Um, so I took it upon myself. Uh, I hope I didn't step out of line here. And if I did, you can tell me I fucked myself. I won't take no offense to it, but I went out west. What did you do, boy? I spoke to Annabelle. And, um... Uh huh. I, uh... Spoke to her about maybe having a conversation with you. Just you and her. And, uh, she agreed to that, if you want it. It'll be just, uh, me and you and her and one other, and, you know, you do all the talk, and I don't have no fucking weight in this. Um, and sort this fucking thing out, put an end to it. Uh, I, I don't live here but you know I do like his you, we're family after all and I want to see none of you get killed over something that ain't even your fucking fight to begin with um she's willing to meet at McFarland's I just gotta send a telegram I'll be there with you. Boy, there's a lot more to it than that. I've been trying to write back and forth to her and she wouldn't agree to anything less than six people. Yeah, well, she said she'll agree to two. I gave her my word. I spoke, I've had a... a little bit of a history with her back when I was here the first time. And, uh... I guess she trusts me enough that my word means something. I can't do much. I ain't part of this. But if I can get you two to, to talk face to face without a fucking army at your backs, then I, I want to be able to do that. I'm really hesitant to believe her, given how quickly she changed her tune, given there was another person that was trying to speak to her on my behalf, and though she wouldn't budge on it. Well, we gotta try, right? Peace is what you want, right? You want this place to be... out of this, right? Boy, do you fully understand what you're going to be walking into with this? I mean, genuinely understand what you may be walking into with this. Listen, if this is going to fucking end, someone's going to have to take a fucking risk and trust. Otherwise, it's never going to fucking end. Until you're up there. Could just as easily end up up there real soon if she's changed her mind was or she's just out. using you
sparen. Alright. I'll send her a telegram, see what she's about. See if we can get this show on the road. Yeah. Right. I'll be back. All right. Whoo! Bam, boom! Thank you for the Twitch Prime subscription, buddy. How are you doing today? Thank you. This could get intense. I got no idea, man, what could happen here. Boy's being very trusting. We'll see if that trust is misplaced. <sighs> so, it, this makes sense for for Boyd to be doing. You remember, he's he's he's, he's a lawfully good character. He doesn't want to see his family getting all shot up and, and whatnot. Especially for Jack. So, if he can help just bring them to the table, like, that'd be huge. It's been, it has been a full day. Uh, Chromic? Chromicus? Thank you for 200 bits. Oh, God. I was gonna fucking take a header then. A lot of horses. That might be her. That's a lot of horses. That was six. I think that might be her. Well, if it's not her, it's her people. Law? Oh yeah, it could be Law. They're heading towards the office. You're right. I think you might be right. They're coming in from out west. Interesting. Alright, let's send this. Okay, what's her telegram? Annabelle. Liza sent that. Okay. What's the what's EST guys? What's EST time? It's for McFarlane's. How do you smell? How do you, how do you smell? How do you spell McFarlane's? McFarlane's? Eight, eight, ten. Okay. All right. Let me read this. I talk now. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm gonna sit here for a second. I'm gonna use the bathroom. 
and we'll wait for this fucking telegram. Um, we need some music. This is going to be quite, this is actually quite intense. So we need something. Um, Let me put something on here. Set the mood. Set the mood. I guess this will do. Go right back, guys. When we get back, we're gonna hopefully do this this meeting. This could we could get shot. Like that's definitely a possibility. Go right back. I just had like, um, deja vu. Sitting in this exact chair as Baz, playing this exact fucking music. I don't know why. Did that happen at some point? I'm, I'm getting deja vu. Green pants and all. What are you going to the forest or something? What do you mean green pants and all? It's like First greeny, off, they're greeny teal. They're, okay, they're you know teal. what? Uh -huh. Okay, do we want? Do we have to talk about rods and cones again? About like I can't see oh. all their fucking colors and shit. Oh, well, are, are you colorblind? No, not colorblind, but I do have a hard time seeing whatever shades of blue you're talking about. Right, you're just like most men. You're bad at colors. Yeah, fine, fair enough. Uh, Whoa! Okay, hello! Uh, no, my mate, just exercising. <laughs> this is the wormiest little what? boy it's... I've ever seen in my life. Wait, wait? Yeah. Uh... Wait, what? what? Are you okay? Yeah, yeah, you... yeah. Okay. Uh, just I was concerned. Uh, two. I was concerned Three. as to why you were dragging yourself along uh, the ground. It's Wait, military I... crawl. It's uh, keep, keep, you know, keep the abs. Uh, two, three, just, you know, working out. That's all. Okay. G'day. How you doing? Okay. 
off to in the face, boy. And I'm just a wee bit concerned about when I'm you're on the floor. totally fine. Where are, you, where are you trying to avoid somebody? No, I know. I was doing the military crawls. It's a, it's a, it's an exercise. Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. I'll leave you two was your conversation. Absolutely frightening. How are you doing? <laughs> How are you doing? I'm all alone. Uh, doing okay. It's been a wee bit of a boring day, so we went and shot up Limpany for practice today. <laughs> That's pretty much what my day has been. <laughs> oh, you, oh yeah, yeah. How's how's the job doing? I like I said, not a lot going on today apparently. So I was actually thinking of clocking off, going to bed or something. Maybe later tonight, stuff will be happening. Right, right. Um. Oh, so you're going off duty, yeah? Mm-hmm. Uh, what are you going to do? I already took off my badge. Oh, so you have. And uh, what, are we, what are you doing now? Uh, well, I was thinking about going to bed because yeah. I don't really know what to do. Right, right. Um, uh, yeah, so uh, I had a good time yes, yesterday. Hi, last night was nice. Yeah, was... yeah. Um. So where where do you sleep? I mean, where I mean, where do you, uh, where do you live? Um, uh, I mean. So, are you headed out of town or? As no. Much as I want to encourage this trip. Can you guys keep it down? Because I don't want to actually hear this. Uh. Okay. Sorry, sir. I was just talking. Sorry, what queen heard? Nothing. What are you talking? No, you know what? You you just have your chat. Ah, sorry. Get off my desk. I'm sorry. I, you know what? I can't even help it, Cleaner. Did you? Okay. Go. Sorry about that. I uh, didn't want to like uh, embarrass uh, you or uh, nothing. Uh, that's fine. I rent the blue cottage at the corner of town, right over there. Oh, is that where you are? Right there. It's on the other side of the barn there. That's a big fucking joint right there. Holy no, shit. Uh, no, no, not there. Not there. No, not there. I guess that's blue too. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, yeah. We can go there. Yeah, no, I can't. Sure. I can show it to you just so you can see it. Yeah. Yeah. I, you know, I, was, uh, I wasn't suggesting you go and let, you know, let me inside or nothing like that. Um, oh, no, I wouldn't do that. No, Sorry. No, uh, no, 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 no offense. I, no, well, none taken. I mean, you know, it's, uh, you're a, uh, yeah. No, uh, that's a nice place up there on the hill, though, but uh, mm. can mm. we really afford to rent out a place that large? No, right. this blue, oh, blue yeah. cottage right you here. Know what? But that's adorable, though. Look at that, like, little quaint little spot, you know? Uh, yeah, sometimes there's some dogs around. Yeah, but, you know, dogs are good. Dogs are good. I love dogs. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, what's your favourite breed? Boy, that's sort of a hard one. I, I like a... You ever heard of an Irish wolfhound? Really uh, big, yeah, tall... Yeah, oh, yeah, they're lovely. Tall lovely. dogs, uh-huh. What is this? Uh... Huh? What's what? Oh, I probably shouldn't... Well, I just, you know, I write and stuff. I used yeah. to write for the are newspaper. You, are you, you alright? It says here, do you, you know, you want to start feeling better. That's, you know... Oh, uh, uh, you know, just sometimes work gets to you, you know, not yeah, yeah. Well, I'm... finding time for stuff that yeah, you used to enjoy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um... So, um, yeah, do you rest anyone today? I was, I mean, I didn't directly do it. I least up the main chainer. Okay, all right. Actually, a main shiner, he, I'm not sure if he still is, but he used to be part of one of the large gangs around here, so it's interesting. It makes you wonder if money's tight or something. But one of them, De Chinzos. Oh, you got, I heard but, about them. I was, uh, I was better. I, I, I saw, so I met someone that, uh, uh, said they laughed like a De Chinzo. Hmm. I, they've got, they sort of, laugh in chorus. I've heard it only once or so. It's a wee bit creepy. Right, I yeah, used I, to... I haven't met him. <laughs> I, I, I'm not quite sure. I mean, I don't get down to, to um, Sandini as much as I used to since I've been transferred out here. But, um, 
I uh, used to sort of have some business with them before I was a deputy. Mm. Mainly, they would end up with my stolen guns and sell them back to me, you know, that sort of stuff. Real, yeah, real yeah, nice. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. And then, you know, make sure, you know, if, if anyone hears about this, you know, you know what will happen, that sort of stuff. Real nice folks. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um. I saw a moving picture today, the first time. Oh, hey. Yeah, it was about this really strong fella who drank clam juice. You know I, where I, you know I, where I, can get I think some clam I've seen. Ah, uh, then I think you'd have to ask maybe the fishmonger or something like that. Yeah, maybe. I, I, don't, I you know. know why they would sell something like that. It's like an after product. Well, it's 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 it makes you strong apparently. That's like the whole thing. Huh. Yeah. You know what you've got to do is watch those motion pictures while uh, Craner in there is doing near eating on it. <laughs> that was that was when I saw it. He sat there and he, uh, you know, because most of them are silent, eh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's got the music. So he sits there and he'll he'll do voices. He'll do the voices yeah, yeah, uh, for the people speaking, and he'll add his own narrative in there. It's it's quite brilliant. I told him that he should make an, an event of it and and uh, you know have people pay to get to get in. It's pretty fun. Did that with him and Emily one day. Right, 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 right. Um. Ah, uh, well. Uh, would you uh? Do you need anything? Do you need like something to eat or a coffee or anything I can get you? Um, I mean, I, I could go for something, I suppose. Oh, um, yeah, yeah, we can go get a coffee if you like. Yeah, that, yeah. I might want to wait till this the rain. rain. Yeah, till the uh -huh. rain passes. Oh, fuck me. Are you... Are you okay today, Boyd? You're sounding... Um... What do you mean? You sound, a wee, you sound just a wee bit nervous. Oh, you know... Or um... something. It's work, work getting to you. <laughs> I wouldn't say it's the work that's getting to me. Uh, you know, uh, you know, it's just after that kiss you laid on me yesterday, and just you know, still I, recovering. I didn't lay any kiss on you. And you, yeah, to be clear, are you sure? Are you sure about that? I'm pretty. I'm pretty sure. I. I think. Well, you know. I think uh, I would remember. You know, I felt the shivers. You know, you know the shivers. The shivers. Yeah, yeah, like the tingle down the uh, the spine there. Uh huh. Hmm. Is is that an Australian thing to just swoop in and sneak a kiss? No, it's more of a Boyd thing. All right. Well, it's been done to me twice by Australian people, so that's Who's why the I had to ask. One? I remember that Willoughby kid. <laughs> yes. He did seems that to, after he seems, kidnapped me. Seems to be some kind of trend going on with the Australian thing. But that's not what it's a... No. Yeah, well, you know... Yeah, but you haven't... Listen. I haven't kissed your lips yet. All right? No, that's a... That's a that's correct. That's a different thing. A kiss on the cheek, that's, that's, that's fine. You know, that's all right. That's a very gentlemanly thing to do after you take someone on a, someone on a nice, like, evening. You know, you have a little coffee, you have a little talk, get to know each other, and then at the end of the day, you give them a little kiss on the cheek, have a nice night. That's 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 gentlemanlike. Am I wrong? I'm sure it could be seen that way. Right, right. But if I was to like slip the tongue or something, then that'd be a problem. You'd punch me in the <clears> fucking <throat> face. That'd be, you know. I would very much punch you. Right, right. Well, mm -hmm. that, I would never do such a thing unless you, you know, you asked for it. Um, um, yeah. So, how you, uh. <laughs> Uh, I, I, I got a problem with, I, I don't, I don't have a filter, you see. I, I um, no, it's just a wee bit. <clears throat> I mean, listen, I mean, I think there's, it, there's, there's is nothing wrong with a little bit yet. of kiss action, you know, it's, it's a, it's a totally okay, natural I thing. I mean, we just, we just went for coffee yesterday, yeah, Wade. I well, I know that, well, you know, you know, nowadays, nowadays, I mean, we're lucky not to be eloped already. <laughs> when you think about it. You know, it's a, it's a joke. It's a joke. I'm, I'm, okay. You know, it's, That's... <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't marry you yet. You know, it's got to be at least a week. Oh, I would hope it would be at least. Yeah, well, at least a week. Yeah. <laughs> it's sort of late up. I think that you can yeah, start well... walking. And you don't have to put your foot in your mouth so much. Well, this, 
you know, oh, worse things than uh, never mind. Um, hang on. What's that? What? Oh, I don't know. Can I just eyeball random people who see walking around when I don't recognize them? You know. He's got a poncho on. It looks pretty suspicious. I don't know what he's got the poncho, but it makes look it makes look like you're up to no good. Am I wrong? Uh, I it does, and that's mainly my own you know prejudices, having dealt yep. with the lobos and stuff like that. Wow, prejudice. Well, you know, just like good quality people who alone. come at me, good quality with it. Well, not if I recognise it and avert it, you know. But when I've been attacked by people wearing ponchos and their hair tied up behind their head, it's sort of, you see that and you, you take pause for a moment. Mm. Mm. By the way, I like the, uh, yeah, the pants are good. I like the color. Oh, thanks. What color would you call that? Teal. Yeah, do, a little, do a little spin. I don't think I'm, I'm just looking. I'm just looking at the, the teal. Uh-huh. Here. Teal. Very nice. That's but good. didn't you hear the conversation with Cleaner? What, what, what were you doing laying on the ground in there when I walked in? I was, uh, I, I, I told you. You know, it, it, you fill, fill the abs. Fill the abs. I, mm, just, just, just fill I, the abs. Just, just trust me. Just feel trust that's me. quite appropriate. Well, it's appropriate when I'm, when I'm, when I'm giving you permission. Just, just fill the abs. Okay. Yep. Just, just, just grab on. Uh huh. Uh huh. You feel I, that? Okay. I, I, that, I touched him. That, that's that is from uh, hours of uh, exercising, and uh, what you saw was the back end of my uh, regime. All right. So we uh, go mopping up telegram station floors with your chest. Well. As part of your. Uh... <laughs> Yeah, that's that's, Listen, that's it's fine. It. It's fine if you don't want to see what you're really doing in there. That's fine. I just sort I mean, of. What do you, what do you, okay, was... well, what do you think I was doing? I did not can. Maybe you were speak. Maybe you're. I did not can. Quainer's pretty funny to pull pranks on. You might have been waiting to scare him or something. Yeah, no, but that's certainly weren't. <laughs> that's not what I was doing at all. I, you know, I was. I think you're, you're overthinking it. You're overthinking a little, just a little bit, just a little bit. No way. I, I mean. Were you in there speaking with Quainer? No, no, I was by myself, actually. Quainer was right there at the desk, though. That's yeah. his office. Yeah, but I was in there before him. Oh, I see. Mm, mm. Now, he's a newspaper editor. He's uh, actually the lead on the paper now. Oh, well, well, that's good. Good for him. I, I worked for the newspaper for about a week and a half before they said I could start ride-alongs. So I ditched him and became a deputy instead. Well, there you go. Well, that, you know... It's kind of what you do, right? You you uh, you find what you love to do and you go for it. Aye, which you know it was. I was a wee bit torn because I actually was enjoying doing something for the first time in a long time when I was doing the newspaper. Uh, but I'd want to be a deputy for so long I couldn't pass up the opportunity. Mm, mm. And I have enjoyed it. I mean, it's been very good. Oh, good. I was kind of following you. Oh, yeah, I don't so, know where I'm going. All right, well, the general store's there. Unfortunately, no one actually sells coffee inside the saloons unless... Oh, we can get coffee, well, sometimes, yeah. Actually, there's, sometimes there's people in there that might sell it. I mean, we could get drunk. Oh, I don't... Uh, you I don't, don't partake? Drunk. You don't partake? No. Why not? My father was a drunk. Yeah, but... And, uh, okay, well... It killed him eventually. Okay, well, you know, that's... You know, that's and you know, my fiancé... Okay, Went and got himself killed after a night of drinking. All right, you know. Okay, well, if, all right. Hello, Mister. So, uh, I don't need. Probably a good reason.